Look at the uh, fucking drip. Hey, Look at the fucking it, drip. It, 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 Look at the drip. You got the Denver Nuggets jeans. You got the Denver Nuggets jeans, dude. <laughs> hey, how's that one going, man? Wow. Great clap. Great you guys clap. know the clap. secret to clapping? Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, every time, don't dude. fucking. Every time you do the secret to clapping, I hate it. This no, is Nick. Hate, this hate, was making fun of Nick. It was I hate you. It was Why? I hate him too. I hate him too. What? Let's, let's go. Yeah. Okay. Fuck you. All right. Well, what's up? Why you look so dumb? <laughs> <laughs> you didn't look. Yeah. Why did you look like dumbfounded? Aiden actually looked great, and then I just looked over him right now. Uh, I think he changed or something. He, he looks did. stupid now. Yeah. He puts. Yeah. Yeah. You look stupid. Also, I you, know. I'm cold as shit. I put a shirt on. Bro, under your it. shirt looks one. Ply. I don't have a sweater. Yeah. You look yeah, like you were. You look like you were shirt. cast it's as a peasant so in a movie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just. I'm just. I'm just cold. Oh, You're yeah, the people you, in Game of Thrones cold. going shame. Yeah. Do you shovel poop? <laughs> <laughs> you thought I looked good with the fucking yeah, blazer the, uh, on uh, over uh, this, uh, dude? Yeah. Oh, you thought I could look good with like a really nice suit jacket on? <laughs> yeah. yeah, with he's with right. This, I don't think it looked nice. I wish Warch, I wish Warch was here. <laughs> go I can go put the jacket. Back go on get the jacket want. and come back. Yeah. Okay. I wish Warch was here, man. We uh, so here we are. Welcome back to the yard, by the way. Where where are we? Uh, this, we're at, we're at this, Outer Limits Tattoo in Long Beach. Uh, this is not paid promotion, but uh, hold on. So. Come down to Outer Limits in Long Beach. Five <laughs> percent yeah. uh, off all Garfield tattoos for the next month. Yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah we went here because they specialize in Garfield tattoos. It's yeah. weird. Yeah, they only do Garfield Flash. It's like all over the walls. Uh-huh. Uh, it's pretty tight. Uh, our tattoo you know, artist is. What was your name? Sorry again. Brandon. Jonathan. Jonathan. Brandon. It's Brandon. It's JonathanBrandon.com/org, uh, and uh, he'll be our he'll be our trusty doctor at, today. At Brandoom on uh, Instagram. Yeah. Uh, at Brand Doom on OnlyFans as well. I, 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 Garfunkel Lover on Reddit. I do think it's funny. Nick was like, I'm like, who's doing it? And he's like, oh, it's, it's this person I've been trying to, I've been wanting them to do a, a piece for a long time. And then it's like the one that. And the follow up <laughs> was, but I, did, I didn't know what I wanted to get from them yet. Yeah, so yeah. I hadn't reached out yet. And here we are. I was, uh, waiting, I was waiting for this moment. With Gar- <laughs> Garfield with a big old fucking hat on. <laughs> yeah. He, uh, he Venmo requested me for the deposit for this, and it just said Garfield, period. Big ass hat. Period. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Descriptive. I do love the hat popping out of the box. Yeah, that was a good good touch. Good. Last minute call. Yeah, good I, addition. Uh, I just felt like it was right. I like good. that. Also, you can't see it now, but when I turn my leg, it kind of looks like a boner. Like it kind of like turns. It does. Yeah, it looks <laughs> yeah, like yeah, the head the of tip, a penis. The yeah. tip is a little ambiguous. What yeah. if we make the not not ambiguous? What you want to turn it in? You want to change want it to turn into a boner? We too, need like, the head to be a penis. Well, you're gonna have now. to rub it. You want that to happen, bro? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, have to I, when involved. I got when I got this one, I was kind of scared because like it it peeks out a little bit, and this part <laughs> right here, I, I sent it to Nick. I was like, it kind of looks like a drooping dick, but I was like, I, I'm happy with it. And then Nick just reassured me. He's like, "No, nah, that's hardcore." Yeah, it's hardcore, dude. <laughs> the horse has a cock now. You tell you yeah. tell me you want that to not be the case. Yeah, I feel like of all people here, you'd be the least concerned about having a drooping dick on it your was, body. It's my first one, and I was just like, maybe I don't want that. Yeah, you know, the second know. one's just dude, obviously. When yeah. I when I was planning my sleeve, I was like seventeen, and I was so excited. I like drew it myself. I went to my artist, and I was just like, "Hey, so I like did like the map of like what I kind of want to look like," and uh, I showed it to him. And the first thing he goes, "That is a penis." <laughs> What? He looked at me and goes, that's a penis you, you drew. You just drew a penis. Did you accidentally draw a penis? Uh, I must have. And I was like so embarrassed because I was so excited to get it. I'm like, oh, oh, oh yeah. I, well, it didn't have to look j- exactly like this. But oh. in my head, I was like, I want to look exactly like this. I'm so fucking stupid. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, and then he redrew it for me. Do you still have a picture of your penis? Yeah, I got a picture of it somewhere. I'll post it in the Patreon. Yeah, that's in the cool. Discord. Yeah. Uh, anyway. Oh, here we are. Uh, Nick is going to get his tattoo while we do the episode. So that's pretty cool. You think some people are yeah. confused why we're here? <laughs> <laughs> that we haven't really yeah, t- they might have missed. They probably did actually miss because more people watched the pod yeah. than watched the 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 context. It was our our, our first big Patreon goal. It was when we get to ten thousand patrons, the uh, everybody in the Discord gets to vote on a tattoo that Nick gets on so my we, real ass body. We hosted a little tournament. We had a bunch of different submissions. <laughs> oh, oh you're like oh, wow, my oh, drip? Is- You are a beautiful woman. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like I'm like every other girl on the patio last night. Yeah. Right? <laughs> <laughs> this, is a, this is a nice jacket. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thank you. That's an I can fix you jacket. We can, we can like talk You know he wrote a bike here. <laughs> <laughs> but we we had submissions. We put them all into a bracket, seated it by <laughs> types of tattoos, I guess. Yeah. I had people. Uh, <laughs> I know. I'm a little embarrassed right now. Uh, and 
Garfield came out on top over the number one seed, which was my face. Yeah, your yeah. face. <laughs> Have I what? dreamed this man? Yeah, it was his face. Part of me wishes your face won still. Wait, it's not too late. <laughs> <laughs> no, this would go against the will of the people. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Fuck people the people. <laughs> fuck the people is actually how I feel too. Maybe, yo, super fuck the people. Let's just not do it. Whoa. Imagine that. Honestly, we go it's- home. Imagine getting all the way here and walking it back. <laughs> Look. I've been around the block. I got a lot of shitty tattoos. This one won't be shitty. It's going to be great. I'm What's excited. What's his name? Uh, Dennis? Gre- Greg. <laughs> Greg Mann. <laughs> Don't talk about other tattooers while you're here. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. That, that off limits? Conflict. Is that in the we'll outer limits? It's, it's in the contract. Don't yeah, bring up her. <laughs> it's true. Uh, so, yeah, we were uh, we were at the the thing. We literally. Streamer Awards? Literally hours ago. Yeah, it, it we occurred. were streamer awarding it up. Did you, uh, you guys, how'd you guys have a good, did you have a good time? Oh, I love the streamer awards. I like seeing people. You say you say it like you've been going to the streamer uh, awards. All those awards, dude. Every <laughs> year, every <laughs> year that shit's fun. I love going dude, there. That's great. <laughs> I thought it was tight. I thought it was it was like in person. I I don't know the experience online except watching you. Let's yeah. stop. Dude. Let's stop the did music you, for a did second. Did you win anything? I won streamer of the year. All time, because he's piping. Because he's piping that person in that movie bro. event. Bro, show, actually, him. show him the evidence. Don't believe it. I don't believe you. Yeah, XQC fan in the building. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's a juicer. Look, look you, I, I can do this because I'm sitting here. I'll find the evidence. You guys, keep yeah. It rolling. Uh, let's let's pause for a moment. Talk about how I'm the fucking Michael Jordan of uh, doing interviews. And, wow, uh, <laughs> you and go ahead. Well, who else? No, dude, it's uh, not. Oh, oh, who else? Yeah, is it Nardwar? Who's, who's Braun? I don't know. <laughs> who's Me <Braun>? again? <laughs> <laughs> Uh yeah no I I was like this this is the one time I've ever relished in uh me doing well at something because I I think it's funny as how little I prepared yeah and I just kind of sent it and yeah it's like, you did send it like yeah you did well if no one saw it you should go check it out but I will say you there got helped out because if you're the like Jordan of doing interviews. JHB is like the JHB <laughs> <laughs> of basketball. JHB on the Bulls. Yeah. So it's not really fair. And he just, and he just got put out on the court. Yeah, yeah. JHB's interviews were unironically like you doing the soft hands guy because he spent most of it trying to do a handshake and it would just it'd be too, he'd be like, Well, hey, that's the bit, right? So it's, much, it's, it's, Dude, ironic. it's his bit, so but much, I think man. what I've realized over time is that it's not a bit. I don't think it's a bit. It's not a well, bit. Well, here's the thing. Okay, but, so, but it's still funny. Like, it is still funny. I, I show up, there's JHB. JHB, there's Nim. I don't know who Nim is at all. Both of them, uh, we, we all just start talking, and yeah. they're both nervous. Both of them. Yeah. And I was like, well, JHB, he's like a kid. I'm like, oh, you care. I see. Mm-hmm. All right. This yeah. Is, yeah. And I was like, uh, we were just talking about it. I was like, you know, giving him like advice, a little bit solicited. And I wasn't trying to be a parent. And then there was Nim, who's like, yeah, I'm really nervous too. And I'm like, He's like, what are you guys? What what are you gonna ask these people? He's like, oh, I'm just gonna ask like who they're really excited to see and stuff like that. And I'm like, and I pull out my sheet of paper that says like, do you ever beat off in the sink? <laughs> 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 like, I guess. Uh, yeah, favorite emote. Yeah, that's what I I'm guess going I'm with. different. <laughs> I guess I'm doing this either wrong or right. Uh, but no, I think it was fine. And um, uh, one thing with the interviews, there was a problem because I was supposed to get. We had like a list of people who were gonna get, and they were given a card when yeah. they checked in said go to station two and get your interview with slime no one looked at their card ludwig didn't look at his card i didn't and uh and i i like missed prezzo i missed like uh, a couple people and i was kind of sad about that but yeah otherwise it was fun. you didn't interview ludwig right i no, was he, specifically he, set to he, interview with him Nim, yeah so i i sta- i literally was like maybe maybe i go here yeah. they're like no you people don't people on lsf were like um you know i think that like I think they were just going toward people that made them feel comfortable, like that they were choosing the interviewer. Right. It's like, no. Immediately abandoned his friends. Didn't. First yeah. word. Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's true shit. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, let's cats out of the bag. I'm the streamer of the year, Brandon. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, bitches? It's me. Uh, and, and yeah, I think now I'm going to start like a new pod. It's going to be me virtual. I'm going to find two fill-ins for you two. Oh, okay. who, Slicker. Who, who's me? Yeah. Slicker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or Northern Lion. And then you'd probably be you got like, no one. you got uh, no one, bro. No, I do. Stance. Andrea Botez. Stance. I was going to go Andrea Botez, Dude. but I'll go Stance. Dude. Stance makes sense. Huh? Yeah. Stance. 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 It'll be me stance virtual Stance does and Slicker. Make sense. Why does Stance make sense, Anthony? Stance makes sense because we went, <laughs> dude, this poor guy 
just literally getting diced up. Yeah, his like, ankles broken left and right. Like like he's just like a, a test dummy, and they're just doing and one like takes okay, on him. Well, explain <laughs> what you did. A bit. Listen, because we went to a party before the streamer awards the, the night, night before, before. Yeah, it was at the the Envy House, the same place where the with a big dramatic story with Daniel happened. Uh, yeah, yeah. And this was uh, just a much better experience because there wasn't crazy people. Just a uh, shitload of people. But there was a lot of people, and and one person in particular went up to you. Are, you, are we name dropping? How you get you getting crazy? Okay. No, we won't name drop him. But I will say this: he's a normal guy. His name's <laughs> really nice. <laughs> Come on, <laughs> his name's <laughs> we, Arch, we, Archie. We, handle that shit. We, we work with him. <laughs> yeah, we work. And he's like, <laughs> <laughs> "Why are you guys no, doing this?" Is fine. this? Uh, it's more of a bit for Archie than for me. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and <laughs> he comes up to me and Nick, yeah, I'm ready. and he's like, he's like, "Hey." How's it going? And he's like, says hi to me, and I like say hi. He's like, literally the first person I see that I know there. So I'm right. like, okay, this is good. I need to talk to somebody. Very personable. He's guy. He's a really yeah. pleasant guy. Yeah, yes. I, I talked to him a bunch last Loves night. Talk. Love seeing he's, him. He's a little. He kind of gets ahead of himself though. And what he did is he said, "Oh, oh shit!" And then and then he looks over at Nick and he's like, "Yo, stands." Like I'm so glad you showed up. Like you're like you're sick. You're up for like rising star, right? And I thought that I don't know this person, so I thought he was just making a joke. And so I look over at Anthony, and I'm like, me and Atrioc just chilling out. And he goes, oh, I already met Anthony. You can't fool me. And I'm like, Yeah, huh? he was like trying to say that I was Atrioc. Right. And then he was like, no, you, uh, you you son of a bitch. And we were like really confused. Like, okay, okay, okay. You almost, you almost fooled me. Yeah. <laughs> so we sort of walk away from that interaction. And I'm like, hmm, Anthony doesn't really think about it. And I'm walking around, and I have this moment. I'm like, oh, my God, this guy fucking actually thinks I'm Stans. I realize it. I run to Anthony. I'm like, <laughs> Anthony, Anthony, there's a person here who believes with their whole heart that I am Nathan Stans. And what do I do now? Yeah. <laughs> and it, it, like, I try to process. I'm like, you know what? I think you're right. And then uh, there was a, there was a conversation in between the the big one where it was like, maybe it was like with Hbox came up to us or something. We like soft confirmed it again. He like said your name, and I was like, "Oh yeah, he totally fucking thinks yeah, I'm Stan." Totally thinks I'm Stan. And I was like, "Do I like rail line of coke in front of him? Like, what do I yeah, do?" We were, at, we were like, "I have so much power." Can you imagine the, most the one Stan's time thing I could do right the now? The one thing, time Nick breaks edge. Yeah, we, we wanted to like ruin Stan's life. Mainline heroin. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Start Anthony's idea. Slurs. Yeah, and exactly. Leave. Anthony's yeah. idea was like walking up to him and like pulling like like three cell phones out of my pocket and being like. Shh! Don't tell anyone. I took these. Oh, that's <laughs> yeah. great. That's just the Prezo. It's like when Prezo tweeted out at the award Dude, show. Dude, that tweet hung out with Ludwig, but he kept saying a slur. It, but he actually no, wrote it, it out. The, the, you got to look at the tweet. Uh, it is literally a work of literature that I cannot repeat it's so or interact funny. with because yeah. it gives it validity. It's a fake tweet. Oh my god! Well, no, it really happened. What what what, what, what is a fake it? tweet? It's like I read it. Like that kind of makes it real. That's, that's if he reads it, it's real. Okay, stands. Let's continue. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, so so we're like okay, and then uh, and we're like. We, we see him later on at the party, and we're like, okay, I have an idea. And Nick is like, I'm not ready. I'm not ready. And I'm like, come here. We go do this now. It's the reason why I felt unready was because... Uh, the, He's in the this, corner watching Stan's videos. This like, person... Well, guys, how's it going? <laughs> this person, and forgive me if I'm saying your name wrong and you're watching this, uh, was talking to Michelle Carr. Yeah. And uh, I saw her in PogChamps. And I'm like, oh, she seems like really cool and nice and interesting. And that's someone I would actually like to meet. But I knew I was going to have to be Nathan Stance in this interaction. <laughs> Dude. So we go up. We go. He's just. It's just those two, and they're talking. And uh, and we go. And I have this whole bit just like formulated in a second. I'm like, okay, listen up. So, <laughs> do you? What are your chances? Both of you guys, you can play along. What are your chances? Of the, what do you think is a chance of Stands here, right next to me, winning, uh, Rising Star of the of the year? And then and then they both like. He's like. Hmm. I think you got it, dude. I think you got it. And I'm like, oh, and, and so this actually sparked a, a big debate. In the, so I'm skipping a little bit because it's important. Um, this sparked a big debate in the Uber ride home because I was telling Ludwig this story and busting up laughing. And he goes, oh, no, dude. She she owned you. Yeah, he was telling the story. He was like, "Dude, I I own these two guys." Like I was there and I was like, "Stands," and they were both getting diced up in the court. And I was mixing them. Their okay, were well, broken. not exactly. And like I was that. like, I was like, "No, you <laughs> actually just exactly got like dunked his, on." And and, exactly and, like and so Lodo was saying that. So Michelle and Stands coached Michelle in the Fortnite event. Yeah. Michelle's and, whole thing is like learning a thing for like a couple months, and she has one person coach her through that thing. And one time she did Fortnite, and Stans was the fucking coach. And I was saying, I'm like, Anthony was there. He saw her reaction. If she actually was joking or like was like basically going along or or owning me back, she is the best actress hey, on on YouTube. Here's the great thing for you, buddy. I DM'd her. Here we go. 
I oh. DM'd her yesterday <laughs> and I asked her a simple question. I said, Hey, Michelle, did you see Stans at the party last night? And then she hit me back with, Stans was my Fortnite coach for six weeks. The man I met last night was calling himself Stans. He was not Stans. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? <laughs> Dude. Oh my So she just God. played along the whole time in her with, head. With, even a, more with sick. a beautiful smile on her face. Yeah. Dude, Literally she, like indiscernible. Because it, it also, the conversation wasn't I like, this is another that. human also named Stans. It was very much like, hey, Stans, remember working at Patreon? Yeah, yeah. Oh, dude, we, we started, <laughs> we're like, Nick just started dragging shit up. He's like, oh, you know, I used to work at Patreon. I'm like, I used to work at Patreon. And he didn't know. He was like, and then, you know, it was, I was like, Gen G. And he's like, oh, yeah, Gen G. <laughs> Dude. Another thing is that oh. the guy we were talking to, he's like, yeah, this guy's crazy. It's actually the first time I met him. I, I was talking to him on Discord like three days ago. So the person we were fucking with has spoken to Stan. Recently. Just not in person. And, and I'm like, this is so funny. So anyway, funny. you got diced. Yeah, so I got diced, which I'm, makes this story so much better. And I, Michelle, if you're watching, that's awesome. Uh, thank you, one, for playing along because it made the guy who thinks I'm Stan's continue to think I'm Stan's, which is so important. Um for later in the story uh and two uh you're great creator thank you for being <laughs> you're big fan big fan big fan the, the question creator. is where along the night did this person figure it out later on no, at the that's award what show I, that's so the beauty. we were at the award show yesterday and i saw stands go up to accept his <laughs> yeah, uh, dude, stands go up to like, accept his award dude and i <laughs> i was at the bar and i was i was thinking about it and i was like this is the moment where it all comes, it all hits. Well, at the once. beauty is the next day at the award ceremony. I'm on the second floor of the event. I'm, I run into the person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and he walks up. He's like, "What's up, stands?" And I'm like, "Still, wow." <laughs> I'm like, I get to continue this joke for another day. <laughs> yeah. And so I'm sitting Goody. there. I'm sitting there. I look over at Zipper Two, and she looks back at me, and her eyes are literally saying, "I will be Stan's wife." <laughs> <laughs> she's like, she's like, I will do what it takes right now, and I want you to know that this makes me uncomfortable, but I will do what it takes. And that's that silent communication it's that you so earn uh -huh. through a, through a relationship. Yeah, and uh, and uh, the, 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 he's with like a friend, and the friend is also being convinced that I'm Stan's through this interaction, and I'm getting <laughs> to a point where I'm like, this is so amazing, and I, it's so much that I think I'll stay here for too long, and I was like. Good to see you, boys. I'll I'll see you guys later. Wait, wish me luck. I leave. And oh, uh, oh by the way, uh, Hitler is cool. Yeah. Yeah. By the <laughs> way, Stan's is fucked up. By the way, more like the whack scene. You ask me, bro. That shit's kind of whack. Dude, uh, it was like Hitler did kill Hitler. So that's yeah. true. He uh, is responsible for killing Hitler. He did the world a solid. I ne I've never heard that argument. It was like she's the man, where you were just with switching. Amanda Bynes. Yeah, with Amanda Bynes, where you're just switching between like. What real stands and fake stands, yeah. Because uh, presumably he would bump into real stands too, and maybe just believe like it's the same person. Dude, that's what I I was waiting for the moment where you know you're just hanging out in a circle at the party, <laughs> right? And then stands and Nick just step up at the same time because then you get to watch the realization happen in person, like to, to be in that circle and and see that guy's face, just like 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 his eye just twitch, <laughs> like oh, wait. process what's going wait. on. Because because then he's like. But then who are you? <laughs> yeah, dude. Smoke starts coming out of his ears. It was, all, it was also pretty tight that I got to be stands in that interaction. Um, because I'm not going to say what, but they were trying. The, the person is involved in a company and they were trying to sell a product. And uh, the his associate was trying to sell me on a product in this conversation. But then he goes, oh, no, no, no. We already sold him. We already sold him. <laughs> and I was like, oh, stands got sold. I don't have to have this dumbass conversation now. That's Easy. awesome. Easy. <laughs> uh, so, so and by the way, fellas, I'm out. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> should have told you. I, I'm not coming for 30 percent asshole. Whatever deal I signed or whatever I promised three days ago, I want you to know that it's not. For and me I want anymore. you. To, I'll accept. <laughs> I'll accept half. I like how if your stands, you're just your evil stands. You're just I, you're you're what is it? Hide. I and he's Doctor Jekyll. I think you're overpaying me. <laughs> I, yeah. I'll say just it. fuck with him. Anyway, you guys know Atrioc exists, right? <laughs> there's, there's. <laughs> you guys know you found out about that one. There's kind of this open-ended, uh, you know, not like ending to this because we don't know the moment that this person realized this insane thing. Yeah, and so shouts out. We're probably gonna. I talk. like to believe they're still out there talking with Stans, thinking that they I, have rapport now. I, so I talked with that that same guy, separate circumstances, a bunch this past weekend. I have his phone number. 
Okay. I will, I will, I will do a follow up, and do we'll find out. <laughs> find out. <laughs> yeah. call, call him. I'm not gonna call uh, him right call now. Him up right now. Right. I'm call not him. Gonna yeah, call yeah, yeah, call yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't be shy. Call. No, I got. I, I, he answers me because I talk to him on uh, on Discord. Look at this. Because okay. it, it's always about. Give him a ring. ring. Let's reveal now. Do you want to reveal who, who the is? murderer was in Scooby Doo? I'm doing it. All right. Let's take off the mask. I want to call. I want to call us right now. If he says I knew the whole time, he's lying. But he might have known day two. No way. Stan's mind, I just told him. You already got diced up once by Michelle. She's a genius. That's a lot of confidence. <laughs> you so confident, Michelle. Michelle, didn't genius of the game. I was so confident. Yeah, you two were having this argument while I was trying to sleep in the car. I, w I was like in the ether, leaning on, no leaning pickup. against the window. No pickup? No pickup. Probably just iced us all out. Probably blocked us all. Yeah, Found it's probably out. off, yeah. The only answer is to Stan, so maybe I should call. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So yeah, that was uh, that was insane that they just happened that way. What else has happened? The party was cool. Me and me and Hassan showed up in the same outfit, kinda. No. And uh, well, we we're, we're <laughs> no. just both we we're just both wearing cheetah print. That's yeah, really it. That is it. Hold on. Anyway, so before, <laughs> before you like fucking really interrupted me, that was so He's weird. He's also left. Uh, so I, I'm upstairs, and and me, Will Neff, and Hassan are in a circle. I kind of walk up to their circle, and Will Neff takes like a double take at both of us, realizes that we're both wearing kind of the same so, sort of gig, and then he points at Hassan. He points at me and looks at Hassan and goes, "He looks better than you do." And yeah. I, was, I dap up Will. And I'm like, my boy, dude, I needed that. That's fucking. That's plus one for the yard. We did need we're that. Gonna take, we're gonna take the millionaires down. I hate talking to Hassan and like literally having to look up. I hate. Oh, it. dude, it makes yeah. me feel like a little baby with a diaper on and dude, a big, you're just a big a fucking diaper full baby. diaper full of he's poop. So, a baby, he's so so tall. When I see him, I can't help but touch his deltoids and slap dude, him around. I, that's what I want to do. I do it I every time. Too. I want to put my hand between his thighs and like do that thing and slap his thighs. <laughs> yeah, it made the funny noise. In reverb. You know what I mean? We were talking about. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? it. It's like if you're, what we're saying, like if you're bald, like Hassan, you can't, you can't do it. You're done. You're washed. Imagine like, bald Hassan. He was like, I thought about this. I thought about this. <laughs> I mean, he definitely mainlines Finsteride. We don't know that. He might just have genetics of a of a lord, uh, probably of a god. Well, you don't Turkish think he has man. good genes? No, he has great genes. Have you seen him? He's like yeah. six eight and built like a truck. Yeah, he's got some good genes. Yeah, he looked like the he looked like the teddy bear that slime has. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, people were making that joke. Yeah, put a picture on screen, Archie. Um, yeah, Eamon, Eamon, God. So I, this is the first time I think I've ever went to a big social gathering where I was like, hey, that was all right. Mm. And that was pretty cool for me. And I was just like trying to be more like Eamon. And then, uh, and then I watch Eamon and he's just like this social lubricant. Yeah. Uh, but he's a greasy guy. He's grease. You get in the, you get in the slime head. He's like, what would Aiden do here? He walks up. I love the social network of the movie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then some fucking dipshit is like me too yeah and you're like wow this is so easy oh my god <laughs> yeah and then you just have to talk about aaron sorkin dialogue for the next 15 minutes just <laughs> when, when, on the plane when they like report the news that's yeah. crazy no dude <laughs> it, it, aiden's insane because there were these times we were all like talking in the kitchen and aiden was like a little bit away talking to like alex or something and uh someone fucked with the volume on the music and it just like <clears throat> starts like going deaf you can, literally can't hear somebody it was next really loud but Aiden, in response to this, immediately just starts dancing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. Like, wow. that's just what he does. What's crazy, if it's on a plane, he just gets mad. He goes like... <sighs> Yeah, because I'm trying, I'm, I'm trying to watch. Now? I'm trying to watch the news. Why room. is it louder? <laughs> they started playing 303 at this party. I, they did. I instantly felt like I was 16 again, and I, I was talking to someone, and the, the volume kept going really loud and then really quiet because like a weird phone connection thing. And I was, I was the person I was talking to. I was like really interested in this conversation. And then 303 just starts blasting. And I, I, I lean over and I'm like, this would make me really mad if this song wasn't fucking awesome. <laughs> and, I, and I was like, let's just listen until this stops. It, it's only awesome because you haven't heard it in 70 years. Yes. That's how yeah. I felt. Yeah. I was like, this, fo this song ah, fucking This, this throwback to like the month where this was cool. <laughs> yeah. God, I, I'm from dress. Colorado. 303 is a big, that's the area code. It's a big deal. They still sell out, I think. Is that where they're, like, they still do shows? Based off that? Are yeah, they the from there? Older. Yeah. Uh. And uh, it's it's just kind of interesting because it's like, it's just the most like cringe ass, like angry, like white boy, like I fuck girls music. Yeah. It's so interesting. Like only for that year was that cool. It feels like. No, nah, they were in like the Kesha era. I feel like where like that music was just, everyone liked it. And you wanted to go to a party and just hear like LMFAO 303. I guess LMFAO. I still want to hear him. LMFAO. Yeah. You want to hear LMFAO yeah, at a party? Get LMFAO on the yard. I want to get down. Yeah. I want to go crazy. Bum, bum, bum. Sure bum, bum, parties, bum, bum. I will say, are I feel like we romanticize them a bit. They're pretty lame. They're yeah. They're pretty fucking lame. Yeah. What do you mean lame? Like I think the one we went to for the streaming rewards was pretty good. 
The yeah, night before. What? what, what yeah. Okay. Hey, party monster. Uh-huh. What's a lame party? Dude, dude. Okay. They had brawl on the TV with two Wii modes. That was crazy. But they mm-hmm. also had like. Wait, that's that's cash. I don't think it, that. Yeah, that's the cash. Money. That's, that's, that's cash money with dollars. Wii modes. It evens the playing field. It's a party game. And they were playing on the Mario Kart I stage with the walk-off. I mixed up this Norwegian it, girl. Are you? <laughs> dude, <laughs> dude. Blood, I walk over. Okay. So, holy <laughs> shit. He's holy blonde. shit. So. So we're at this fucking party, and there's <laughs> no mercy. Just dude, no, no mercy. No mercy. Oh, listen to what Kirby, I did to her. Dude. So, so, we're, so Super Smash Brothers. So, I, so I don't, Brandon, I don't know if you know this. So the way that the four of us all met was competing in Super Smash Brothers. And oh. we met at tournaments. Dude, um, who, do you, do you who do you play? Who do you play? Do you know my crush? My fucking who? my celebrity crush. Princess Peach. No, I don't know who that is. Mewtwo King. <laughs> Oh, Mewtwo King. <laughs> that you? No way. You just said a unique <laughs> sentence in the universe. It's <laughs> only been said once. No time. one has ever said I don't know who Princess Peach is, and I have a crush on Mewtwo King. Yeah, I would, <laughs> I would wreck that dude. He's so hot. Wow, wow, <laughs> damn! I would wreck that dude. He's so hot. I'll well, tell you what. I have a direct a line to Jason. Hold him yeah. right now, please. I, I oh will yeah, not do that. Is his name no. Jason? Yeah, Jason. yeah. 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 I, I won't call him Jason. He, I'll call he him. He messages Jason. me once every couple weeks and says, "Hey, do you want to come to my my tournament?" Yes. Uh, <laughs> the answer is yes. Uh, I have yet to reply, uh, but <laughs> left him on red, bro. This is the most I, niche I have done that. niche simp. This is crazy. Thing I've ever this is, seen. This is incredible. So anyway, so we have a bit of a background in the game, and at this party, Super Smash Brothers Brawl, the worst in the series, is on the TV. Mm. and only Wiimotes are available to play which is to me is pretty cool because it's just like at least there's a fucking video game option here yeah uh, I'll get down uh, but it's on like a plasma screen there's like eight seconds of delay it's pretty fucked so much delay I walk up and uh, I walk up to Ludwig at, the, at some point in this party he's talking to Double Lift and Double Lift's like asking him for like tips on his like YouTube channel and I'm like this is a crazy interaction I just want to like third party this uh, and then I, I walk away. I'm like, love it. We need to call an Uber. He's like, hey, he's like, take my phone, do whatever you want. So first, I tweet at Tom Brady. I say, washed. Uh, <laughs> second, you? yeah, that's so hard. Fair. Yeah, Fair. Did you delete that one. I didn't delete it, but yeah. the drafts were raunchy. I just wanted to say that. I, I wanted. <laughs> I, I wanted to say it. my idea was better. Yeah. What was yours? Well, it, Aiden wanted well, to use his un- bisexual unaccept- privilege that to say something much more. That was the drafts. <laughs> that was uh, in the drafts. Uh, <laughs> And so, second, it, it would have hit. I pull, up, I pull up Uber. Ludwig has default the black SUV Ubers, so it was a two hundred and fifty dollars Uber home. So I went to confirm to him, "Hey, do you want to do the? It's only three of us. Like, do you want? It? He's like, "Yeah, call it. Yeah, black. Yeah, I like, I like doing the nice ones." And I'm like, "That's crazy. Our Uber, the the rear view mirror was digital. It was a camera feed. Oh yeah, yeah, I see yeah. those. Yeah. And I'm like, damn, this is really. I'm like, th- we're still scrunched up in this car." <laughs> you know? We are still well, all we, in the back we, seat. Sh- we willingly scrunched because there was yeah. another. I, back I just like feeling Ludwig's thighs on me. Um, and so, anyway, so I walk up. Safe. I walk up, and uh, he's playing against. Uh, I don't want to say some Norwegian girl. What was her name? I like dropping some Norwegian girl because it sounds cool. I, no, like, it sounds her, demeaning. Her her t- her name is like painfully Norwegian. It's it's like Majij or. Something oh, like, like her her Christian it's name. Like, it's like not, M- not like her no, tag. Her, sk- her tag. So her name her was tag. Mer- her oh. name was Meryl like, Streep, and but she pronounces it like a Scandinavian. So and it's I walk like up, always difficult to say. They're yeah. on Corneria, and Ludwig is playing Kirby, and she's playing Captain Falcon, and Ludwig is camping the edge. Random abs- characters, random stages. And Ludwig is camping the edge, absorbing her, and then running off the stage and killing her. And it's not even stocks. Dude, he, it's a time battle. <laughs> so Ludwig is doing this until the timer is <laughs> over. No, so, we're at a, so, who we're hurt at you? a fucking so, we're at a party. Yeah. We're at a party on Wiimotes on a plasma TV against somebody who's never played the game, and he's playing like it's chewed at at first like, stock. At, at fucking first stock. Yeah. Yeah. Twenty fourteen. It's, it's a two minute timer. First you stock, played honest. First stock I play honest. I get it to like a hundred percent. I side B her. It brings up the hammer. It goes yeah, and then she flies <laughs> off top. And then I realize it's not stocks because I didn't like I didn't look. And then it's uh, it says like my, like minus one plus one, and I'm like, oh, this is dumb. So then she comes down. So now she has to suffer now. Then she comes down. I absorb her. I walk off. She dies. And it's, it's like, like, how do I punch? And every time, by the way, <laughs> yeah, right. you're like, yeah. Fuck you, noob. <laughs> <laughs> every time she she's just like she's like, what do I do? And Ludwig's laughing at her. She's like, you suck. Oh my god, you're so well, bad. So what I do to her is like, it's there's like it's time. There's no way she can win. There's about 15 seconds left. So she's just dashing on the main part of Corneria. I'm on the right side. Now she's scared. Yeah. And so then I say, hey. If you want to win, you have to approach. Yeah, he's like, he's like, you have to come to me. The game's almost up. six, five, four, and she's like screaming and running towards him. And then he gets one more in. Uh huh. He gets oh one more God. just jump to plus in. four her How instead of plus three. Amazing, amazing. <laughs> Literally so worth. And then she was like rematch, and I said no. Yeah, he gave her no. You didn't give her the one. No. Well, I to left. be fair, the Uber was here. The Uber was here. Uh, and then I look over at her. And I'm like millionaire, by the way. 
I literally <laughs> looked at her. I said next year, and then I walked away. Yeah, <laughs> this is literally how Ludwig and I met because I I wanted a money match and he diced me and then he like left and I'm like, damn that dickhead wearing Tim's just fucking made my day worse. So she's gonna go bald and be my manager soon. <laughs> <laughs> Can't you really, you have to change you. it off. Change it off. Yeah. <laughs> also, at that same party, <laughs> I've been hanging out with Austin a lot this weekend, and I love Austin. Yeah. I, I have a newfound love for him, even though I liked him before, uh, just because I did an IRL stream, and I hate IRL streaming. It's like uncomfortable, and it's a different skill that I don't have. And he's great because he's just always Austin. You know, he's always like just chatting and being. I mean, the cool. car we were talking you have, about you have, have a good personality to live stream. I think. I yeah, think, yeah. I think well, but well, best in the world. Good it, personality to live stream. It, it's about stream grease. <laughs> He, we were talking, and he yeah. has a lot of grease. He's and, greasy. And like Will Neff, he's just like he, he's like a social lubricant. In the sense that you can like talk to them, and it just like it's it just slides. You just feel better. There's never any friction. And and Ludwig was saying that Will Neff has so has so much grease that he has to spread it all around. Big greasy guy with all yeah. his greasy and he, share. And he feels well, he, he's like he's greasy. Like he's playing. He's playing like Splatoon. He's got to like get his grease everywhere. You know? Yeah, he's, yeah. He's, he's he swimming. He yeah. swims through his grease to get places. I faster. saw him in the party, and he would actually walk around to people, <laughs> and he'd be like, he'd be like. Tens and he'd be like yeah. doing this to him. Yeah, and I then, love that shit. And then he like, I don't yeah. care that he does it to other people. And then like 15 seconds later, but Austin is like when when he when someone enters his AOE, he just stands there with them until they leave, and then he's back to being like NPC. <laughs> so he gets summoned again. Yeah, they uh, play. They both play the same role in the game, but they have different abilities. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, can we can we talk about what Hbox did? Well, hold up, hold up. So Austin, <laughs> uh, one ten. Austin. Your IRL streaming. We're at the party, and I've up. been hanging out with him. So greased. The thing that's been bad, though, is that he is obsessed with doing a Trump impression. Oh, what? He does it. Have you not heard it? It's a little no. late, I feel like. He does a Trump impression at least, I want to say, five times a day. Uh, you know what's funny? He didn't do... I talked to him a lot at the party. He didn't do his shit around me at all. Yeah, well, Cause, probably. Because I bet he's probably bringing his A game. And he did. He's yeah. very funny. He kept a corrector on you because if you, he doesn't, you're gonna send like a tweet out. <laughs> yeah. Talking about on the pod. It's, it's kind of like guy with like a Trump impression is like kind of like guy who can do a Rubik's cube. It's like okay, you're one of the people who figured it out. Leave me <laughs> yeah. alone. I don't care. This but was the, so cool a long time the ago. The bad thing is I was drunk. Oh, so you loved that so shit. I started doing a Trump impression. Oh, oh my no. god. Oh. And and Trump impressions are like a virus. Like when you start doing them, you just like keep doing them because every time you do it, you get better. Well, the thing yeah. is, when it's you're when like you're when you are literally a homosexual man like Austin, the, the the irony is baked in that you're doing the Trump yeah. impression. With you, it's too vague. Well, that's what I told him because we were, we did an IRL stream and uh and there's a lot of people around. He's doing the Trump, and I was like, you make a little too much money, and he's like, yeah, that's the gay privilege. That's why I'm allowed to do this. Yeah, <laughs> and I, he's like, it's actually better being gay. <laughs> and I was like, oh, you're so right. <laughs> Uh, but anyway, yeah, I, I was, uh, I was, explain we had, we had this bit going where I was like, uh, cause we were, we were talking about in particular the F slur and who was allowed to, and not allowed to say it. And, uh, and he was like, uh, I, I have this theory that if you're bisexual, you can say it once per fiscal quarter. Yeah. And then, uh, and then Austin was like, yeah, that makes sense. But what if like, if you suck a dick, you get one back. And I'm like, <laughs> I've said that before. Like, so he arrived at that independently. And then I was like, also, it doesn't roll over like minutes. Like, you have to use it in the corner. <laughs> right. It's and, like a Twitch Prime. Yeah. And then I said, and, and it's, it's your responsibility as a full gay man to report this to the Bureau of Homosexuals <laughs> to make sure that everything's on the up and up. So it was this very, he, 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 he was right in line with, you know, how I see the world yeah. then, in the, terms of who you, can say you what. You guys are the same. At some point after this conversation, I'm hanging out with Austin downstairs, and he is presenting the theory to he me. Is, <laughs> dude, he presented it. He's like, listen. And there's like five people. He's like, I'm gay. And he's like, he kind of got like a like an approval from yeah, each yeah, of them. It's so, a head nod for everyone. <laughs> it was crazy. Mm-hmm. And then he, and he, and then he it. says and, the and then, and then he pulled a whiteboard out, yeah. and he's like... <laughs> <laughs> Pulls out his long, pointy metal rod, <laughs> slaps it down. Oh, like, to wrap up last week also, our our gay off, Yes, Austin came up to me because Austin had a, a gay friend when we were out at the club, uh, and his gay friend after asked if I was gay to Austin. Oh, wow. Interesting. The thing is- What did you say? I, well, he answered on my behalf. The thing is, he had to ask about you. So it went- yeah, I it, guess you didn't have to ask about you. It went from- at the, at Worst case from this story, it went from a shutout to you got one on the board. Yeah, it's like ni- it's like ninety nine one. It's ninety nine one. I love Aiden's confidence in this in this matchup. <laughs> I gotta give it to him because he was so smooth with the dancer. Yeah, Aiden. Yeah, Aiden. Aiden's great. Aiden, you're a, you're you're. If anyone's grease, it's him. Mm-hmm. I would, <laughs> if I didn't know Aiden, every time I saw him at a party, I'd be like. 
please, please, please. I need come towards me. Uppy, 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 uppy. uppy, 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 uppy. I, yeah. <laughs> I was, I, I was thinking about this on the way here. How, uh, you know, people when people go to parties, uh, you know, some people do a little. Some, some drugs here and there, you know? Drugs, it's true. Drugs are at parties. It's a known fact. <laughs> I know. I know. I'm I know. sorry. It's I'm, true. It's I'm so sorry. sad. I know, bro. <laughs> and and I mean, there's definitely like cliche, like cliche party drugs, right? Don't let this influence Garfield. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Make those eyes bloodshot. <laughs> he just writes sinner into your leg. Like, <laughs> be hard. <laughs> that, that would make the tattoo fucking rip. <laughs> just says world is a fuck. It's in the it's in the black metal <laughs> font. <Yeah>. Lasagna. <laughs> <laughs> I, so I was thinking about how yeah people like show up. People have like a uh, we'll do a little little party drugs here and there. Uh, typical stuff. And uh, I was thinking about last night. Everybody with their suits around. What if you? Like the next time we go to something like this, what if I just brought like a gas can with me and I like huffed it, but like while I was in a suit. So like, <laughs> you know, like somebody's doing like coke you're, in the corner. You're just like talking to him and you're just like, <laughs> yeah. yeah, so you just, dude, yeah. you, you just have <gasps> silver on your nose and mouth. <laughs> you're like Charlie. Yeah, fuck, Getting like really casually into like huffing gas yeah, at, paint. at parties, but just still decked out in the same way. Like, or you're, like, or you're you... like turning the canned air can upside down and, and fucking inhaling yeah. it. You guys want to whip it? <laughs> you're like, yo, you want to do coke? You're like, no, nah, man. You pull out whippets? Yeah. That's you great. pull out, hey, I'll make you a pup, a pup chino, and then we can do something. No, dude, dude, dude the, the, the easy cheese actually has better air inside. It actually gets you more high. Bro, bro. Dude, there was like a this reminds me of Faze Banks. <laughs> yeah. Faze Banks tweeted today because uh because Mike, the guy who's on Logan Paul's podcast, tweeted out like like gas prices are so high. And then Banks replied, You're a millionaire. Next time you get gas, get an extra gallon and drink it. And I thought that was so <laughs> that fire. Is, that rips. I thought that was who, who so did he say fire. That to? Mike, I can't pronounce his last name. He's part of Logan Paul's podcast. Oh, okay. That's he's, funny. He's just yeah, yeah, that's right. right. That, that is, is really and, funny. I, and I saw that and I immediately went to open I bought an NFT. I was like, I'm on board. I'm on board. He got me in. Fuck. It's a it's a monkey drinking gasoline. <laughs> that's, that's punk behavior, bro. Yeah, that's punk behavior. Okay. Dude, punk. uh imagine I as you you started talking about that. I just imagine Stan just walking around just with a little Jankum jar. <laughs> <laughs> oh I wanna you guys laugh. Try my Jankum? I wanna laugh so hard at that, but I don't want to fuck the tattoo up. <laughs> <laughs> You like that Stance? one? Dude, the That's what I'm trying to It's homemade. Hey. Rochelle, Rochelle chipped in too. Hey, Trev, you want to hit this? Oh, I got the Jankum Jankum. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> no, Stan, I don't want your Jankum, dude. Just get, get, get your fucking Jankum away from me. That's it, Trev. Oh, man. Uh, squeak, oh, squeak to that. What a, oh, squeak, squeak to that. I squeak hate, to that, hey, Trev. You don't, want to, you don't want to stop my Jankum. Well, maybe you don't want to be my friend anymore either. <laughs> Uh, I really want to t- t- touch on what HBox did at this party, which yeah, was please. which was well, two things, oh. two things, <laughs> two things. I- the first one is not this. The first one is he comes up to me and Anthony. And he goes, guys, 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 like like there's a big. I imagine Smash related because he targets us. Uh, he's like big announcement. He's like, dude, check this out. And he shows us a picture, and he's like, Drake has cornrows. Forgot about that. <laughs> and it's a it picture, was crazy. And it's a picture of Drake with cornrows. He's like, dude, Drake got cornrows. Dude, and I can't. I was, I was, I think it was. He'd be like, yo, Putin declared war. Like, yeah, you know. <laughs> this was, this was an insane interaction for me because I was like one social group over from you guys, right? So I look over. And he, he came over to me first. I'm talking <laughs> to somebody that I'm meeting for the first time, and it, the conversation's going. He stops our conversation. To tell me that Drake has he's going group now. to group showing and, off, and I'm like, I, I saw the photo. To be to be fair, the photo was, I was like, this is this is weird. This is this is <laughs> no, a weird dude, photo, dude. He, here's what happened. But, he comes up, he comes up, <laughs> and, and he, then I watch him walk over to you guys and do the exact same thing. What was your response? Was it like, oh, that's crazy? I said that makes me mildly uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I didn't give it to him. <laughs> I, <was> like, <laughs> I, I didn't give it to him. He comes over to me. He's like, dude, like, I'm like, what's up? What's up? He's like, Drake has cornrows. And I look over to Anthony like, why did he just say that to me? <laughs> I look back at him and, and it's a tweet. So I go, will you let me press like on it on your account? And then he ignores me and presses like himself. Yeah, we watch him do this. <laughs> and then, and then. And then we all like laugh about and it. And we like, laugh, oh, you laugh. just took away from him. Oh, shit. And then he walks away and Slime catches him turning the phone and secretly unliking the tweet. That's right. 
and then walking away from us. And, and like, he goes to me like, dude, he unliked it. Yeah. That's, I was like, what the fuck is your so game, funny. Juan? Dude, I want to go so check funny. right now to make sure he doesn't have that tweet liked. Dude, he doesn't. I watched him do it. Unless he, unless he was in the Uber just like admiring it, be like, you know he what? And then, he, and then he's like, you know what? I actually do like I want to like this on my own time. <laughs> What's the other thing Juan did? This part of the tattoo is kind of hurting me, bro. I'm not going to lie. You, you need me to take over? It's a little sweet. A lot of our patrons are, you know, our viewership are like, you know, children that are stupid and and worthless probably never had a tattoo yeah yeah fair enough why don't you describe what it's like so the way i always describe getting tattooed i have a lot of them is it feels like a cat scratching you where you have like a sunburn like that's usually how it feels that's racist it's racist to cats. <laughs> Two people that can't get sunburns. Oh, That's actually true. true. Oh, fair enough. Problem. What about all your black fans? That's uh, the thing, though, is like I'm trying to represent white people. This is part of white culture. <laughs> what about what about, getting, all, what about all your black fans? Getting sunburned is white culture. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Along with being hero. a podcaster in Nick LA. Nick from the yard, a white icon. Disposable income is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You yeah. have your thing. We have our stuff. Yeah, like, like, <laughs> well, I'll, I'll I'll let you end the bit here, and uh, <laughs> and I'll uh, continue with this tattoo. Uh, yeah, it kind of just feels bad, but there's certain parts that feel like, oh, you know what? This just feels like my bones are vibrating. Yeah. And then there's other parts where it's like, ow, bitch. Yeah. Bitch, the, ow. The bicep, I was like, damn, you son of a bitch. Stop what you're doing. Yeah. For me, the areas that are like more fat usually hurt more, I feel like. I feel like there's more nerves that get they get fucked with. I you, don't know the you, science. You're, but... you're sticking, Uh Can I ask you an important question, though? Like, what, what do you feel about Drake's cornrows? Drake's how, cornrows? Yeah, how does it make you feel? I feel like Drake has a way of making everything seem like cultural appropriation. Yeah, Drake, will, yeah, Drake, Drake has this like thing where he'll like release an album and all of a sudden he's like from Barbados. <laughs> and it's like, how, who signed off on this? And then he like met Skepta and like now he's a road man. And I'm like, Am, are we all cool? I'm looking around and everyone's bobbing their head to the music. And I'm like, all right, I guess we're cool. So I'm like, it's like a ditto. <laughs> Dude, he even he, he was a cult, he, he was a culture vulture, but then uh, he kind of just became like a guy who wears costumes for Halloween of all cultures all the time and he I was just like, did it enough that people got yeah I guess we're it's like Chet Hanks oh, it's like Chet Hanks he's, yeah he's he's a way more successful black Chet Hanks yeah <laughs> right Chet, Chet Hanks being like the riffraff of actor sons no he's right. an unsuccessful black Chet Hanks. Chet Hanks is the black Chet Hanks <laughs> yeah <laughs> what else the other thing Juan did well Juan he oh the other thing was he came up to our group and he goes Aiden can you get me a beer the beer is equally distant from both I of them I can't believe dude he goes can you get me a beer Aiden and Aiden goes yeah and goes and gets him a beer, and then and then Anthony leans over and he's baffled. He, he's baffled, <laughs> and, and Anthony goes, "Did you just command Aiden to grab you a beer?" And Hbox looks over and goes, "Yeah, bro, PGR." Yeah, <laughs> which which to Brandon. Let me explain this. Also helps the viewers. PGR is the uh, the ranking of the Super Smash Brothers players in the world. He he at one point was number one in the world. No, so he was not pulling. He was pulling rank. Yeah. Over Aiden. On someone who, if the PGR extended, is probably like in like the seven hundreds or something. Oh. If you know it, uh, <laughs> it's less egregious than this. Nope. He asked me to open it, and he didn't know where the bottle opener was. Oh, oh so you didn't fair. go get him a beer, but you came no. back with one. Yeah, I, uh, the one that I opened. I I had a beer. You took it, went to go uh, open. I it. still find and then this I, funny. Um, maybe I, still find I got this funny. mine. He that's still said the PGR because he said thing. go open this for me, and that's still that, funny. Did he command you or did he ask you? Ooh, he commanded. He commanded. I don't remember. Anytime I Aiden doesn't remember. know, he commanded. He commanded. Yeah. Here's the thing. I, it's so <laughs> funny because uh, until you guys said anything about this, this interaction was totally normal for me. Yeah. Yeah, that's the problem. We're like, yeah. we're like your, <laughs> we're your girlfriend telling you that he's bad for you. Yeah. <laughs> he's bad for you and you, we no, shouldn't hang out. No, I love one ten. Like right? I love the one ten. No. I, I had to do the same thing. They had like no bottle openers, so I was just opening it on furniture. <laughs> It was bad. That's that what, wasn't I went yours. up to Alex at one point. I was like, "Hey, do you have uh, a bottle opener somewhere?" And she's just like, "I don't know. People have been opening them with spoons." Yeah, <laughs> you're your own brother. It is kind of like your bag of tricks, where everyone has their one way to do it. Like mine, I just t- I put it on a piece of wood and I yank, and then some people like get another bottle and they do like the opposite. The bottle, twist. the lighter, dude. Yeah. dude and no. those some freaks do teeth. Teeth are. Uh, I love a teeth guy. I, I hate, hate a teeth guy. <laughs> Dude, I hate a teeth guy. I grew up in the rural woods. We had a lot of teeth guys. Teeth is like nail on chalkboards for me. Yeah. I hate looking hey, at man. it. Millionaires are crazy shit, dude. I went up to the host of the house and I'm like, hey, do you guys have water here? And they're like, oh, uh, they're like looking around, like, I don't know. I think there's like an empty Brita somewhere that you could like fill. With Wait, the sink. this this was at the party after the war show. No, right? this is the no, party. no, this was there. Oh, the, the, I'm talk- I was gonna say there I'm was a water to, problem at both of these parties. I'm talking to Alex Botez. <laughs> It, I'm like, do you guys have like water? And she's like, I don't know. I think, <laughs> I think there's like a Brita maybe somewhere like on a counter. And I'm like, 
okay, you live here. That's weird. Anyway, she's like, we have gin. That's clear. I'm like, maybe. I'm like, maybe, is there ice? And she's like, uh, she's like looking for the fridge. I'm like, I'm like, you live here, she's, dude. She can't. They they don't they don't know where water is. But she just made me a coffee. But. That's so. That was so weird. She made you a cappuccino. I was watching yeah. that, and I'm like, they're just Canadian bonding. Did right you now. ask for a cappuccino? Yeah, somebody else got a co- coffee, and she's like, "You want one?" And I was like, "Yeah." Oh, and yeah. She, she, oh, I forgot. I totally forgot like, this. Damn, nice the whole, because, because of this whole stands interaction, I was just in this mode where I just wanted to mess with people. I didn't want to be myself. I wanted to be Who other people. Stands. Stan, where do we start? That's so a he, great question. He's a guy. Who is stands? Well, he, in in one sentence, he's a rising star. <laughs> So he won at the award show. He won Rising Star Streamer of the Year. So like the <laughs> fast, largest growing small streamer. Even though when also I rip, a, a friend of ours. When I rip a Valorant so like, stream, like, I get uh, way winning more winning best amateur porn star. Yes. It, yeah. If there were better amateur porn stars out there, but you just won. Also makes more money than an amateur porn star, unfortunately. You don't know that. Mm, no, yeah. I, I think yeah, so. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I know that. I pretty yeah. confidently <laughs> say. Uh, there are <laughs> there are amateur porn star streamers. There's also professional porn star streamers who play the video games uh, who have transitioned. So uh, the money must be better. <laughs> so to, to streaming streamer, games, not yeah. transition. <laughs> yeah. uh, so I, I will say, stands. So he has. Whenever I rip a Valorant stream, I will get more viewers than him. I dude, you're just wrong. You don't know numbers. I literally can see and interpret numbers. So so at best at best <laughs> he gets at best he gets more viewers than stands. At worst he cannot read. I just Which we think, think is he true. He's bad at calculating averages because he probably looks at his peak and then. No, goes, I don't. I literally have a fucking thing that says how many viewers hey, I have on my stream. What's the number? Ten eighty one. Ten eighty one. Usually. Oh, uh, he blows stands out of the water. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> you, you haven't been paying attention. <laughs> Unless stands is playing motorsport manager, in which case they are equal. Well, <laughs> either way, hold on. Just to return really quick. Okay. I, yeah. I, I'm messing with people, and I met someone. Uh, I'm forgetting their name right. Tap L. Tapple. Tapple. Yeah. 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 Minecraft. Uh, Harvey. Met, super nice. Honestly, uh, felt bad about fucking with them a little bit. Um, but um, I was trying but to I say did. I was trying to say that I am stands to this person, and uh, Alex Botez immediately chimes in and is like, "He's not. He's not. He lives with Ludwig. He's not stands." And I look over. and I'm like, "Dude," and 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 he's like, kind of confused, like, "What?" And uh, you show me your that's, badge. That's, that's you Canadian doing? honesty, right and she, there. And she, no, it's Canadian narking. She's like, me- <laughs> she's like melting into a puddle. Yeah, have every country. Yeah. <laughs> she's like melting into a puddle. She's like, "I'm so sorry. I couldn't do it. I'm too embarrassed." And I'm like, "Dude," and he's kind of like. Are you fuck with me? I'm so confused, and uh, I'm like, F- I'm I'm sorry, man. I'm I was messing with you. I'm yeah, sorry. I was fucking. And then with he you. I'm sorry. he kind of leaves. I go to her. I'm like, what the fuck was that? <laughs> and she goes, you don't understand. She starts freaking out. So like, you don't understand. When I was a kid, my dad used to make me play chess against older men, and he would tell them I didn't know how to play, and he'd be like, she doesn't know how to move all the pieces, and he'd make me beat them because he thought it was funny. Yeah, what did the horsey do? And then yeah, 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 what did the horsey do? And then he make me beat them. It was so traumatic. And I'm like, oh, calm down. It's okay. I'm, it's all right. You don't have to. You don't have to mess with the best anymore. You know what the horsey does. She's <laughs> breathing, she's like breathing heavy. She's like, oh, I'm, so, I'm like, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> resurface childhood trauma. She literally was like, I was traumatized as a child. You brought that back out of me, and That's I'm like, great. I am so sorry. That's classic. You are heard. If anyone did, it'd be Nick. <laughs> what is that? You're mean? a trauma bringer. <laughs> yeah, I, dude. I gotta be something. Hurt at, people hurt people, bro. Yeah. That's right. True. At the uh, at the award show, so I got I got sat down. I actually was gonna be in the nosebleeds, but then Cutie moved me next to Ludwig, which was kind of cool. And it was only cool because I was I was next to Jerma uh-huh. the whole time. Oh my god! Let me tell you, I fucking love that guy. I so love Jerma. I love Jerma. This when you guys mind. when you guys hang out with other streamers, do you guys call each other by your fucking streamer names? Because awesome. it's kind yeah. of fucking cringy. I know. <laughs> yeah, it's kind it of is. Cringy. It is. But you, you, you have to ask them like, do you want to like be called your name or your tag? And usually it's like, ah, I don't care. Like when I hang out with my homies, I'm not like. Calling them by their Instagram names and shit. It's fucking weird. Right? Yeah, well, it's different. It's, it's different. different. It actually right? so it's much different. related to your it's so related to your identity. Like uh like so Anthony's online name is Slime. And when I met him that, no, that fits though. I like that more than Anthony. So well, but that's, that's the thing. That's, no, that's good. That's Same. good. The fact that you can even have that, most pe- you really only call the people by their name when you like that more than their name. That's like kind of the people who also, stick with their name. Sometimes you know their name online more than their real name. Like, like do, a lot do, of do, yeah. guys, you might not even know. Name? Saikuno's name? Saikuno's real name. Nate. No. No. No, I don't know. B- it. Bill. I don't know. Take a stab. Uh, Tim. Chris. Chris. Close. Thomas. <laughs> but nobody calls him Thomas or yeah. Tommy Boy. That is crazy. Uh, yeah, I so didn't I even think, know that. I think, yeah. Is I think that a it's, reveal? No, you, it's like known. Hey, Saikuno heads. Hey, Leafs. You just added someone, dude. That's right. <laughs> Their name. <laughs> Docs. <laughs> Look out, Leafs. This guy's your, this guy's your next target. <laughs> Leafs. Um... <laughs> 
Oh yeah, I was next to Germa. Yeah, Germa. Uh, we just we you know we just start chopping it up. We're both. He's, he's great. He's old. I'm old. It was great. He's he, older than you. I know. Mm-hmm. He's thirty six. He's yeah. got seniority. And uh, it was just awesome. It was really nice to talk Discussing to him. Discussing walking cane options. Oh, oh my god, dude. He was like, Germa's so funny because he he's very easy to talk to. He he likes to run a bit. I start writing Bush at nine eleven on the coloring book because I know the camera's gonna be on me and Ludwig, right? And it's true. <laughs> That's what I said. That's true. Yeah. And uh, and so. And I'm holding it up, and Germa just sees that I'm writing a message because we had those coloring books, and he's like, "Oh, wait!" But he didn't read it. And I'm holding it up, and then the camera shows on Ludwig. We start dying laughing. Dude, that screenshot is so good. <laughs> Your reaction, Archie. Archie, Archie yeah, if you can Ludwig's bring this up, if you can bring this up, there's a screenshot of them. It looks like the Oscars because it's very similar, and it's just a screenshot from the show with like a nice graphic overlay. <laughs> and then it's, I tweeted it's it. Slime holding. It's Slime holding the Bush did 9/11 coloring book. <laughs> And it's Ludwig like pinching his nose, like, oh, yeah. dude, don't embarrass me in front oh. of my white peers. Oh, I was just <laughs> laughing, actually. <laughs> it's so sick. Yeah. And then, uh, and so I put it down, and German's like, wait, what does that say? You guys are fucking crazy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, he's like, that is so fucking funny. And I'm like, thank you so much, Jerm. I appreciate it. Jerm was that. great, dude. dude uh, he Feels was the, good for him to sign he off, was, right? Uh, so good. He dude. was the only person I met, and uh, I talked to him a little bit, and he was like, I love everything that you guys are doing. And I was just like, no, don't say don't that to s- me. Stop. No, don't, I'm like, you don't, I held his hand. I took his hand, <laughs> and I said, Jerm, you don't understand. You are the only person doing anything. <laughs> yeah, please. <laughs> you have to please. understand that no one else is trying but you, and it's so awesome. Please he, like me. The first thing I said when I sat down, he's like, oh, yeah, I know who you are. I, I watch the, the Yard podcast. And I'm like, please. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was like, no you, no, you don't. It, it, a lot of times it's like, because a lot of the people there, it's funny how nervous they actually are, which you don't really realize. I like, think that was a, whole a big underlying theme through the whole event, actually, is that all of these people, at literally every single one, it came up on the red carpet specifically, uh, we're nervous. Like mm. nobody is actually that comfortable in this environment, which is funny because they all do this shit all day, well, no, every you for, day. You forget. No, they don't because they just do it they're, alone, they're live medium, in their room. Yeah, their medium is in their room. Yeah. So when there's like actual human energy buzzing around, they're like, oh. Fuck. It's in the room, and they don't like push themselves. to yeah. Do new. But things, it, it's I think. funny because I don't. Well, it it, it, it it's just it's you not wouldn't that think of it because often what we think of celebrity is like someone who's comfortable doing that. Yeah, yeah. This but new, in this world, it's not. You know, dipshit celebrity with no talent. You know, you put him in a big room. That, that peepo video. Oh, I dude, love that's that. So shit. cute. Did you it was a people video that it was oh, like I just didn't remember it very well. There was a people video. It was it was made by I forget his name. A guy who made a lot of people animations. It's me berating this people. I'm like I am not your they friend. Took, they took I will clips. Never be your they friend. took clips from all these people's streams, but then like animated it as if it was happening at the award show, and they were talking to people who was a who was symbol wa- for chat. Yeah, who was walking around and like Ludwig's berating him. and He's crying, and then the next one is XUC consoling. Oh, him. that's right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's so cute. X is like hey little buddy, yeah. it's gonna be okay, man. X had a good time. Uh, at the award show, yeah, I hope. Is it, is he, so like, let's let's dig into this. I Wait, want... really really quick, okay, really quick. Please, yeah. I'm sitting next yeah. to Michael love... Reeves. Michael Reeves. So the the seating is Lily, Michael Reeves, Ludwig, me, Jerma, Jerma's girlfriend, and so I'm I'm there. And that guy walks up who does the uh, the battle royale. He accepted ACU. The, a, no no no, it wasn't ACU. Yeah, it is. No no no, it was if someone was it ACU accepted the battle royale. It was. It was. Mm-hmm. It was. It was. was wearing that all black stuff. Yeah, yeah. with yeah. glasses. <laughs> don't get don't get me lit, Michael Reeves. Michael oh, Reeves does dude. rip the greatest joke Michael I've ever Reeves. heard. Dude, I, I, I don't... Simon messages me the joke, and I, he, they might have heard me laugh from the top story. Michael Reeves said the funniest shit ever. He leans over to Ludwig, yeah. and he's like, he looks like a school shooter if he could tap strafe. <laughs> 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 and, and, and Ludwig tells me that, and I'm like, I'm dying, and I'm like, uh, and I lean over, I'm like, dude, that's so funny. And then Michael's like, imagine him in the library. <laughs> oh, no. And I'm like, this guy's goaded. Dude, Michael's no, so funny. Dude. So fucking that funny. Is, Michael actually spent the entire award show because because to entertain streamers, they gave everyone Peppa Pig coloring books. Yes. And Michael spent the entire award show making a, like a drawing that was like at first good coloring in the lines. Then he added Minecraft armor <laughs> dude, <laughs> to his drawing. Jerma, Jerma grabbed. He, he did, we, we were all like running our own like quiet, isolated bits. Jerma grabbed crayons. He's like, sun is orange. Like, this is only for me. Right, <laughs> me, him, and his girlfriend, yeah. who are only people paying attention. Yeah. He's just doing this, and I'm like, I, I was like, stay inside the lines, kiddo. Where's the cat, by the way? <laughs> yeah, 
It was great. Uh, and not flavored Cheerios yeah. was the snack. Unflavored? Yeah, yeah. they were not really? honey That's nut. fucked up. Well, cholesterol. You know we got Wheat those. Like, like babies. Like babies at a table. Yeah. It's like white people don't have culture. That's right. <laughs> that <laughs> that <laughs> Yo, I love the seasoning on this shit. You got <laughs> this Cheerios. Gross. You got school spicy. shooting. Spicy juice. <laughs> <Wait, what>? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That, uh, yeah, that's uh, every every February eighteenth is is our is All part national of a, a balanced breakfast. <laughs> you got to celebrate your IRL KDR. Uh, yeah, uh, I got Clay Boldios. <laughs> I was really happy. Uh, I was really happy. Tarek won best FPS streamer. Dude. Yeah, because I was like, he he deserves it, right? Like he's the man who deserves this, and he gets up. Uh, or not, he, he doesn't get up because he's not there. The video is about to play, and it's silent, and I was just like. That guy won the major. Yeah, I, like, I, that I was you. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 And that. I got like two laughs. Like it's I heard, like everybody in this fucking room doesn't know this man fucking saved yeah. NA Counter Strike. All you guys don't know about this man's accomplishment. No, he tried because he didn't end up saving it. He hey, did. Uh, he kept it alive for a few years. Mewtwo King was not there. Mewtwo there was a Smash there. category that he was not nominated for. Why does he get, keep getting snuffed, bro? Like why? I hate for him. Well, he I have a question stream for you. Smash anymore. Yeah. Yeah. What's he streaming these days? Kingdom Hearts. He was on that kick for a while. Oh, yeah. Shit. If I Hearts told like you, me. if I told you, Mewtwo King was writing a book. What? How would that make you feel? I don't know how to read. <laughs> Easy. The so, average Mewtwo so King fan. Angry or <laughs> 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 frustrated. Uh, yeah. So I'll keep on the Smash one. Mango didn't come. That's right. Uh, which was a big point of contention for Cutie. She it, like has been Here's working on this event for a it. few months. And and like any time anyone would drop like Schlatt backed out last second because he, he just had moved and stuff. She was like, oh no, Schlatt's not coming. Like it, like little things would just kind of set her off. So one big point of stress was Mango not going. So I kind of took a like a responsibility. I was like, I'll try to get him to come. I'm friends with Mango. Nothing. <laughs> I'm throwing the fucking book at the guy. I'm like, I got him a custom keyboard made, and I sent him pics. And I'm like, you come, I give you this. He's like, <laughs> he was like, cool keyboard, Lamau. And then, and then I was like, let's make a bet. You, you don't have enough badges for that yeah. Charizard, bro. And I, and I kept going. and I, I, I'd pop in his chat, and he just banned me because he, he didn't play League. And I was like, oh, I can't do it. And so eventually, I just gave up. He doesn't show. He doesn't make a video either. And yeah. you're supposed to make a video if you don't show up, uh, like, like Tommy and, and Tarek had to. Uh, and, and so I'm, I'm there in the, in the foyer, and Hungrybox comes up to me. And he's like, yo, Ludwig, I have an idea I want to run by you. I'm like, yeah, what's up, man? He's like, Mango's not here. He's probably gonna win. If he wins, what if I just go up? Like I have a ripper speech, and like it's gonna be like such a good clip. I'm gonna like I'm gonna say fuck Nintendo, and it's gonna be like such a big thing. And I was like, I'll get back to you. Don't do it unless I message you. And then he says, You're not gonna remember, so I'm just gonna do it if you don't message me. <laughs> That's <laughs> and crazy. I'm like I'm like which, okay, which That's is a- I'm stealing that. A dope, a dope option yeah. select. If I may. I'm like, that's crazy. Yeah, because so, now the onus is on you to message no. Well, yeah. Okay. So Good. he had he had told this uh, us about this at the party. He <laughs> right. was like gassing up the speech he was gonna make. He was and in, gassing his and speech. in my head, I'm like, I, we've we've I, all, we've suffered some wand speeches. I don't know day. if this is the that's event what I was worried it. about. I don't know if this is the so event for I it. I ran it by Cutie. She was like, chill. I ran it by Atrock, who's presenting the word. He was like, cool. Uh, and and he goes up, and I'll say he knocked it out of the park. Yeah, not I, memorable in any way, shape, or form in the grand scheme of the but, award show. But I didn't think Rude it was tone. cringe, and that's arguably more important. But it wasn't. He kept it tight. He kept it nice. Yes, and uh, it's, it's because Ludwig told him to keep it tight. I don't know if he read because he wasn't answering my DMs when I said that. I think he was like like seeing them and not reading them. Just so so high, high I energy. I even messaged IBDW. I'm like, tell him, tell him, tell him. Yeah. <laughs> well, Ludwig at least made an attempt to be like, hey, you know what? How you feeling? Wrap Great. her up. I was personally disappointed Mango did not make it because he lives so fucking close to where it happened. I like couldn't believe He made a good he... tweet I afterwards. It. Yeah, I saw what he said. I respect it. You yeah. respect the no-show? Yeah, fuck yeah, that's tight. <laughs> Award shows are not <laughs> he, as beat. He, he is a Mango fan, he just doesn't know it yet. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> You'll be off that Mewtwo King chase soon. Award shows aren't as beat and he was t- just tweeted that he was socially anxious. I mean, he definitely could have done more just as a friend to be like, hey, I am not going to come like say all of what he said yeah. after, before. Which is just handles everything. Um, Cutie, Cutie's funny because she like she she just like me. Fr Fr. Dude, it's sad because the award show was a banger, right? It had three hundred eighty five k concurrence, which is yes. like the most viewed thing, bigger than anything me X or Miz have ever done ever, uh, and and like one of the largest events for for NA streaming. And and I go back home after the award show. I'm like, how you feel? How you feel? Is it good? Is it? And she's like, I feel nothing. <laughs> I'm no. like what? And he told me that, and I was like, 
That's re- that's real as shit. We're the same. That's tight. Yeah, that's we're the same. We're real as shit, dude. Because yeah. because it's true. I, I had this talk about in Ludwig or w- in the car with Ludwig, and I'm like, yeah, I, I understand that because like some stuff doesn't go perfect. You want it to go perfect. You're mad that it didn't go the way you like envisioned it. You like you just don't care. Like you you have this dedication to craft. Ludwig was like, I don't know. I, I like being happy, and I was like. <laughs> I don't think I do. <laughs> Dude, it's like it's like after after Smash Summit, like when like me and Anthony were working the same events, we kinda like after the event's over, you kinda walk over and you're just like I mean, you wanna play melee or something? And yeah. Like, I don't know. Like I don't feel full right now. Yeah, you just don't feel full. Are you full. like me? I get like I a, like a post coitus goitus glow. <laughs> oh yeah? Yeah. After after an achievement. A I wouldn't nice, call a nice it a healthy. I nut. wouldn't call it a glow. I, I, I think I I feel a, a very large sense of like relief and like maybe accomplishment like the hardest project i ever worked on i it ended and then uh i was like i'm gonna go to dubai by myself and then that's what i Dude, and then project. and then to hide away from the world and I then that's think, how i handled that <laughs> so i don't think i've ever like what i don't think i've ever watched a piece of content after smash something like after the event like unless it was like oh reviewing it reviewing or referencing it, yeah. or whatever like I don't think I've ever like when the event ends those are all dead to me I don't even remember sets that happened unless they were like insane like grand yeah. finals yeah. or something yeah I don't you think know? you I don't think you hang on to like sets or like moments it's more like this I, I think it's this collective pressure is just like released because like now now everything has fuck that I've been watching it all yeah, because money. you got the fucking sleep on stream it's not that you can't be no, happy I haven't watched it. It. I don't think I'm, I was talking about mogul money oh yeah yeah I was watching that the other day I was like it's great. <laughs> <laughs> I love this. They should make this. <laughs> yeah. me, me and me and uh, Ludwig were talking because we were walking down. I parked in the LA Fitness and oh I was like, God. "They're gonna tow my car. I gotta go get it." Yeah. We're walking down the street. X just flies by in a BMW, and he's like, "That was a streamer of the year." Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, it was so funny. It was just for us. It was just yeah, really funny. And then we uh, and then we started talking, and I was like, "I will say the the XUC uh, soda pop in and um, Seer Seer episode." I know that name. Soda pop. Soda pop. He wasn't there. A person I know. That's I know. I, Do you watch him? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well. Yes. Well, he only because he plays uh, Elden Ring. Oh, that's he right. Does, okay. Cool. cool. Oh, Soda Pop is rip a good Soda magic Pop I'll say it, we've met, I've met like at this point. I feel like most large streamers at least once. Uh-huh. He is delightful. Yeah. Like, yeah he is great. probably one of my favorite people I've ever met. I feel like life. I have a good taste in people. Yeah. yeah. Like I feel like I have. A How do you feel about us? Like generally. Uh. Yeah. If you want to go through. You're a fucking monster. That's fair. Uh. You're a sweetheart. Oh, thank you. I, I like you. I don't really. You, you seem funny. Cool. Bald. Just say bald. Oh, I mean, I'm bald too. I'm part yeah, of a club. Don't yeah. fucking do ah. that. Fuck you and your full head of hair, both of you. All right. I, I probably would have had a good thing if I said you. Your full head of hair. Chill. You seem really young, though. Uh, how old do you think I am? I should say like 27. <laughs> Yeah, really, young. bro. Are you like eighty? <laughs> <laughs> bro, you really you're, gonna, you're gonna hate his age. We were trying to uh, guess his age. He just like eight. we kept whiffing. I'm uh, I'm 25. Uh, That's two years. Aiden, off. Aiden is 24. Okay. Uh, 31, 26. Yeah, dude, I'm a monster because I toss one Norwegian girl in brawl. No, you shouldn't say no, it that whole, way. Add whole, brawl faster. Your whole energy. What? Is just you black. made that too you clippable. Black energy. You said I tossed <laughs> one Norwegian girl. I did. Dot dot dot. In brawl, you should just say that faster. So rad stats. You know what? That you might on. just be my streamer brain. <laughs> <laughs> you know, after a while, when you have an out of context Twitter account, you start farming. Oh, speaking of Nick Allen joined. I, this is the first podcast. Nick Allen, we have poached Nick Allen. Everyone yeah. came out to me at the party and was like, "I this I, I never saw this coming. This is crazy. Yeah. I didn't. It recognize is crazy. Him. It is crazy. Dude. Like imagine this from an outside perspective. It is crazy. Yeah, Dude, I keep remembering. He that. came yeah. up to me and I've only when I met him and every time I've seen him, he's been wearing a beanie. And he came up and I was like. At first, I didn't recognize him, and I was like, "Oh my god, what's up? Hello!" And then I was like, "I didn't know you had hair, <laughs> dude." That's, what, that's what it's like when I met you. Yeah, you yeah. always wore a beanie because you were beanie you a guy face. for dude, six months. Dude, Anthony, Anthony, well, I once didn't wear a beanie in front of Anthony, and he said, uh, "I thought you had cancer." <laughs> <laughs> I did not say <laughs> yes, that. Yes, you did. Really? Yeah, you were joking, but you did say okay. that, and I laughed, and I'm that's like, "Funny." I she's like, "Why the fuck are you wearing a beanie all the time? Fucking full head of hair. You fucking pissed me off." And I was and like, "That was when I had hair, yeah. and I was still and you're mad. still mad about yeah. it, yeah, because yeah. you knew it was gone." So, so yeah, yeah. But dude, you, you Nick, get a couple years where you know it's going. Yeah, yeah. but you hold you on. Get a warning, yeah. You grow it out. You have your last hurrah. Nick take, Allen, take a uh, lot of pictures. Hat, wear hats. Nick Allen was walking around to the. I was so excited to see him, because uh, this is the first time we're. This is the first time since he like locked in the job that we're yeah. seeing him in person, 
And uh, I kept doing this thing whenever I saw him around. I would tell whoever was next to us that he's coming in to say, like, to save our sinking ship, like, to save the company. <laughs> That's everything. Yeah, is going was describing downhill. it as like we like to get into the kitchen every week and burn twenty thousand dollars. <laughs> yeah, the I was doing that. And Nick was, Allen it to him like, like, no, 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 and like putting it out and like waving his finger. We're in a, we're in a <laughs> circle. Shit. We're in a circle. It's me and Atrioc talking. It's like it is. I. I it's it's almost all for Atrioc. I'm like it's like yeah we uh we do this big thing. I I feel like old like corporate fudge over here is gonna ruin that part. We just like burn money in the house. <laughs> but <laughs> yeah, we <laughs> we can't just like buy overseas shit that we never see anymore. So that's yeah. uh that's yeah. unfortunate. Jackie, yeah, I, I didn't Jackie Chan statues are out as soon as this man comes in. I didn't recognize him. I literally didn't know what Nick Allen's human form looked like. Mm. I only had talked to him on Discord and stuff. He comes up to me. He's like, hey, and he's like a older guy i'm like who's this adult <laughs> <laughs> and it's funny hearing you say that too yeah, and i'm just because you're always the old joke guy but then you're like who's this fucking old yeah, guy yeah, between and this guy and germa right you're you were out i was a young buck yeah. yeah i was a thick bull you have so many years left yeah they go to you they're things. like 31 you got your whole life ahead of you yeah <laughs> hey, you oh, Gary v. Hey, so you're I, so young I, I, you're so young nick allen and he's like nick allen and i'm like ah, and i hug him and it was great dude germa oh my god I fucking uh, are you allowed to say where he lives? Like what state? Well, you can't say specifically the city. Yeah, he lives no, yeah, in Vegas. Yeah. He lives okay. in Vegas. Yeah, yeah. That's known. So Wait, uh, what did you just say? You just said well, we can't specifically like the, say the city, and then immediately guys, said the that's city. That's like saying you live in L.A. You guys are dumb. You it's not about that big it. of a no, city. He just said it stupid, and he's defending himself, which he shouldn't do. You guys right. are just dumb. Okay. We're yeah. No, you're. Don't. The bring, problem no, is the problem with that state is you can't say it because it's like if they live in that state, they probably live in that city. Uh, no, you can live in Carson. <laughs> or, or Reno. Reno. So, are we okay. doxing him right now? I don't think we're allowed. I don't or, know. Or we're allowed Elko. To do this. Shout out to Elko viewers. Let's just say all the cities he doesn't live in. Probably. So, <laughs> so, so we Ger don't Germa lives in Antarctica. Uh, anyway, Germa lives in Vegas, and uh, and I'm, I'm talking to him. I was like, oh, like, you know, my, my dad lived in Vegas. Like, I've been, I like, spent a lot of time there. And uh, he's like, oh, yeah, I love the lifestyle. Love the lifestyle. I'm like, okay, that means he likes to gamble. It's like, all right, Germa, how, uh, how down are you gambling? And I was like, but I didn't ask him that because it's always rude to ask unless you forfeit your number first, right? Mm -hmm. So I told him the number I'm down lifetime gambling. You know it? Yeah, uh, roughly. Can I Dude, know it? I, I, don't, know I it. don't know it. Can uh, I know your number? Guess, guess. I want, I, no, 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 no. Don't take guess. A no, take I'll a just, stab. No. Yeah, it'd be fun. Take a stab. You guess. Oh, what's, yeah. your, what's your game? What do you play? Poker and blackjack. Um, Lifetime down? Yeah. No, man. You're probably in a different tax bracket than me. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just say... 30k you guys want to take a stab yeah i would like to take a stab i think you are down a hundred and fifty thousand dollars 110 i know so yeah it's like <laughs> it's a hundred ish okay right nice. so you know you get the price i right. win the cookie i win the so, cookie so this is over a couple years all right I get, a couple <laughs> <laughs> you guys don't know how it was bro, bro, I edited. Bro, you said a couple years like that like oh it's better you need bro. to meet normal people sit around <laughs> <laughs> go to a, go to a bar. Bro, no, no, you don't understand. No, no. Okay. He was like, he lost the majority of this before, before he had okay. money. Before, so think before about Amos that. had money. Worse. Before Amos had money, you have to understand. <laughs> he slept in my closet for seven months. He paid rent in the house I lived in, and he slept in my closet. And he was like this then. So he could pay two hundred dollars a month Just living big in big divorced dad energy, dude. Yeah, <laughs> without the dad or the divorce. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Your son. And so, so I'm like, uh, by the way, I edited for False Swipe Gaming. A lot of people, if you watch False Swipe, uh, like. How good was Clefable in competitive Pokemon? Really? I have a couple editing credits on those because I know Kellen and I'm like, hey, I need some bread because I've lost all of my, I have a zero balance right now because I lost everything gambling. This is back in the day. Yeah. And, uh, uh, <laughs> I owed, I owed Ludwig 500 bucks. He would yeah, pay, this he, was back in the three years ago. Dad. He would pay don't me. Pay, don't pay he, me well, back. It was back in the day when he was like a broke streamer. He would pay me in QP, which he called quest points. So basically I'd pay down my debt. <laughs> Remember, I knew you were a monster. Yeah, I remember when, doing when, that. When you had to dye your hair. You reinvented slavery on accident. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, labor. labor. Like, I have a great idea. No, I got a great idea. Just work for me, dude, for free. But <laughs> <laughs> it was saying, oh, dude, it was, I was just dude, when you When you had to dye your hair, remember? I was yeah. like, he's like, do you want QP? And I'm like, yes, because <laughs> I have a debt to my friend. He's like, all right, I give you, I give you 50 QP if you go get hair dye from Walgreens. And this, bring is it this back. when he was selling vapes to children? Yeah. 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 Okay. So just a merchant of death and 
and, and a slave owner. Slave well, owner, okay, yeah. no, I was not. Uh, say, okay. say what it is. Renter, renter, renting. He didn't own. He didn't a own. renter of a human. No, it was own. because I, he owed me five hundred dollars and he couldn't pay it, and he was like, he wasn't comfortable being like just like write it off. Well, I would and never do that. Exactly, but you also weren't in a spot where you could pay it back. So I'm like, what if we just do this, and then this will be <laughs> a better he, avenue. And then, and exactly and then he opened happened. a PowerPoint yeah, exactly presentation <laughs> about fucking quest points. <laughs> So it's called QP. QP. You're like, yeah. how do I sleep at night? I gotta, I gotta invent a way for you to pay me back. So, uh, then so you I, get level ups, dude. So I tell Jerma, I'm like, all right, I, I, how, how, how down are you lifetime? I'm down a hundred grand. Jerma's like, like, like he, he, he's like, oh, like I, I punch him in the stomach, and he's like, Jesus, and I'm like, oh, well, what about you? He's like. I don't know, like seven grand. And I'm like, ah, little, little country mouse. Jerma runs a nice tight ship. He just does it for enjoyment, pleasure. He's yeah. not much. Because I was like, he's like, what do you play? I'm like blackjack. He's like, oh, I fucking love blackjack. I love just like playing blackjack for like a couple hours. And I'm like, yeah, me too. I just fucking keep going back to the cage. <laughs> yeah, the, the slime, literally the slime, is going to Vegas with slime, and you're like, you've been there for maybe. Six hours, and you're like, "Hey, what's up? You want to get food?" He's like, "Yeah, I'm down seven grand." <laughs> and then you're like, "What, dude? We've been here for like no time." And you're like, "Yeah." And you're, you're always chill. You're always like, "Ah, oh, like, I'm gonna bounce back." And I'm like, "I believe you." And then then we all go like to bed, and we wake up. Slime never came home. We go down. He, we, he walks into the room at eight a.m. and he's like, "Yeah, I uh, came all the way back up. I'm up eleven k right now." <laughs> and you go, "Dude, what?" But, That's he, but he has like fifty k in his hand because he's like, "Oh yeah, no, I went down like forty five. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It and then I ran it back. Yeah, right yeah. Back. and then and then it's like net three. And whether so you like if he at some point he usually goes up and you're like cool all right well we have four hours left in the trip so walk away so he's got a victory away. and then he always leaves down fucking like six or seven grand or whatever I'm the always. poster child for like how casinos get you yeah by just I'm, like I think I'm lifetime up lifetime but, up no yeah, bro, bro. Yeah, that's I'm, hype I'm up like oh, I mean it's not like big money but up dude, is up. I'm, up, is I'm up. up like 10k walk that's away. that's, oh, that's great I haven't so been I am not I haven't been to Vegas this is this is a great corner right now the Rolex. Fuck you and your fucking spreadsheet, oh, brother. This is going to be the most depressing podcast you've ever done. No, gambling's hype. Speaking so of spreadsheet, I talked to Blouse Choice at the party, and uh -huh. he has a spreadsheet for gambling. Because uh -huh. he goes, like, all the fucking time. They go to Vegas, and, like, all the GTA guys. And he's like, he's like, do you want to join the group? And I'm like, what? He's like, we're trying to build a secret group. It's me, Leslie, and Ray. I'm like, okay. Names the group immediately. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm join. not in it. I'm a journalist. <laughs> yeah. and, then, and then he goes, he didn't say off the don't, record. He, don't reveal your source. <laughs> and this is like unprompted. Like he didn't have any preamble before this. And he's like, yeah, it's called the Empire Building Group. And I'm like, what do you mean? He's like, yeah, we go to Vegas together. And then we try to build an empire. And it's just what they call going to Vegas and gambling every month. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. It's just a big fun excuse. And, and yeah. the empire is actually this hole that just gets it deeper yes. every, every yeah. trip. Did you know? It's when reverse the, empire. When, when the count is minus 14, there's a 0.01% edge. <laughs> and it's like, and we're going to take the casino for it. Yeah, I, I love the idea of streamers just being dog shit at counting cards, but going, being millionaires and still losing. That sounds awesome. It's not even that, dude. The count was so good, and I started shoving it in, oh. and I just didn't hit. And I'm like, yeah, because the edge is it is like a tiny little, you know, Nick sized penis. Well, it's so true. Like Nick Engling, right? <laughs> so true, Bessie. Nah, he's no. actually got a no, hog. Probably okay. you. Yeah. All right. It's you. Well, it's like, oh, I'm so in on this bit, dude. <laughs> dude, it is small. Yeah, me too. It's like, <laughs> all my relationships suck. <laughs> <laughs> Love so. the robot. Uh, uh, <laughs> Let's talk about stream of the year. No. No. How about we talk about how fucking fucking in the middle of the theater, Rich and Mia made out Ooh, for what must true. have been half the show, dude. Yeah, well, that was weird. I for was, I thought it was a bit. for a good 15 minutes, I'm like, this is kind of funny. And then they made you it You thought through. it was funny for 15 minutes? No, because like the fact that they've done it for 15 minutes is like the bit, right? It's like, oh, damn. They're really, Ace watching they're, for 15 minutes. They're really sticking this out. And they're, uh, this is this is how it started. It's not a bit. My uh, my date my I hadn't seen this at all. And my date points down, and she's like, "Do you are they talking?" She's like, "Ew, are they talking or are they making out?" And I looked down. Well, first she said, "Is that Mia Malkova?" <laughs> <laughs> Dude, real quick aside, yeah. Lily and Michael they're next to each other. Mia Malkova goes up to to do that award, right? Yeah, another and, name I know. I yeah, know. yeah. yeah. <laughs> are they a, they're a streamer? Yeah, Sa Sasha Gray. I mean, come on. Yeah, I mean, they're, they're, household name. Yeah, uh, I feel like yeah, I feel like the, the applause was a little louder. I'm a man of culture. <laughs> <laughs> so also a streamer now. So I'm I'm right next to them, and Michael, he's like, uh, 
it Lily Lily turns to Michael. They're actually so fucking cute. It's crazy. She's like, Michael, who's that? Who's that going up? That's He's like, really funny. I don't know. I don't know who that is. <laughs> I don't, I've never even, I don't know who, who's that, Michael? It was really, my, really cute. You know what my guilty pleasure content is on YouTube right now? Is I'll just watch shorts of the two of them interacting. Dude, it's real shit. I know. It, it's like, this is this is like what reality TV was to my fucking parents. <laughs> this I, is, I also, I, I fucking confronted Lily Pichu because Ludwig made me. Remember? Oh, yeah, because I said Lily... People must say you have a fake voice. He thinks you have a fake voice. Yeah. And then I point out She outside. turns over. She like leans over. She's like, oh, you think, so you think it's fake? And I'm like, I'm Anthony, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> and then she goes on to say that she's like harassed and bullied. No, she, having... did not, she did not say that. No, she did. To, not to me. Yeah, to me. Oh. Talked about it for like five minutes after about how so many people accuse her of having a fake voice and she's been harassed over the years. That's insane. Well, we had a delightful conversation. I was like, okay. I don't believe it's real. She's like, that's okay. And I'm like, but you as a human being in front of me right now are telling me that that is real. And she's like, yes. I'm like, I believe you. And that was that. At the Envy house, so it's me, Point Crow, and uh, Point Crow's manager, Abby. We're all in a thing. And she sees me and Makova. She's never met her. And she was like, should I go up to her and tell her she's really pretty? And I'm like, I look around. That sounds like something that someone would want to hear. Yeah, sure. And you're a girl. I'm like, go ahead. That sounds great. So she like leaves to like go tell her that information, and me and Point Crow kind of like sit there and we're like staring at each other, like nodding our heads, like watching her talk to Mia. I look back, and I'm like, "Do you feel an insane amount of like guilt surging through your body right now?" And he's like, "Yeah, I don't think I can go over and talk to her." I was like, "Me either. I was in middle school. I, <laughs> I was like, I don't think I can. Dude. I don't think I can go over and talk to her. I think I want to throw up right now." And and I'm like, "I'm sure she is lovely and great, but now I'm repenting for my sins, and this is you know this is I, where we're all at." It was interviewing Sasha Gray surreal. You interviewed her? Yeah. Th- last night? Yeah. I actually didn't I realize that. she was there. For yeah. the award show. It was, yeah. I don't know, it, it might have been recorded or maybe, no, it was live because people were talking yeah, about it. Yeah, it was live. Uh, and it was like, it was crazy because I was like, you, I'm just, look. Uh, oh, what about her? What about, what I, about her? You know, we're actually not that different in age. She's like a couple, like, she's like two years older. You have a lot yeah. in common is what you're saying? That's what, you have a lot in common. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm saying it'd be a lovely time. If we yeah. just like shoot your shot. Dude. It was a really, it was a really good interview. But it was just, I, it, and during it, I was like, fine. I was just in the zone. But after, I was like, it is so crazy that she is here, and then me at 16, and, and you know, whatever. It just yeah. goes through your head. <laughs> yeah. It just goes through your head. What happened when you were 16? Shit out of my dick. Just Tasha Gray <laughs> videos. <laughs> Big of you. Yeah, and I downloaded them. You down? I had to. You downloaded. You remember LimeWire? <laughs> I have a. I actually have a theory about uh, foot fetishes and how they came to be. I really? don't know. Uh, you're how old did you say you were? Thirty one. Okay, so you had a dial up internet when you were younger. So <gasps> imagine you're a kid. You're jacking Super off. Super freaking out. <laughs> you're jacking off. Yep. You find a you find a thumbnail of a of a person, a boy or a girl, man or female, horse, whatever. You uh, click download and it starts fucking. Five, five kilobytes per second. You Six fucking, if you're lucky. You're, 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 you know, you're fucking a young man. You bust at ankle level because your <laughs> internet sucks. Boom, foot fetish. Dude. That's crazy. I haven't tested this. I mean, it's a hypothesis. Though. I'm, I'm working on it. I got to hire these scientists, but I think, <laughs> I think it's credible. I think it holds water. I think it does hold water because yeah. we have all been eight seconds into a video that has been downloading for a half eight hour. Seconds? I mean, right? That's generous. Jesus it's Christ. been downloaded for a half hour, and you're like, I got shit to do. Yeah. I got soccer practice. <laughs> you know? Yeah, I... My so, mom's coming home. You, know, yeah, you, gotta exactly. get, you gotta get shit done. Yeah, this is the family computer. Exactly. This is this is the generational gap between me and you. I know. Amen. You're you, blessed. You don't even know how blessed you are. Yeah, Aiden, even Aiden, was, Aiden was beating his shit on a Nintendo like DS four, with Wi-Fi. 4K video streaming. <laughs> there, well, there's a different gap from even you and probably your fucking brothers. I don't want to think about that <laughs> at all. What do you think happened? Think, think about bro. your brothers beating their shit. <laughs> Go on. Go on now. What's it like? <laughs> no, I just said... We like Fortnite. Don't. We like Fortnite. Uh, Fortnite, Fortnite, <laughs> Fortnite. <laughs> <laughs> you yeah. know how many people jack off to Fortnite girl butts? Uh, I, I will say. How many? I mean, so many one at people. least. <laughs> <laughs> Let's start there. I, one at the very dude, minimum. <laughs> I, we're, we're the first time we were ever playing Fortnite. With I was playing with Miles when we used to like queue it up, when, like, and we're just <laughs> playing, and he's just like making his character run forward, and he's like, "God, this girl just have like the absolute dump," <laughs> and I'm like, 
Yeah, <laughs> but it was like this solemn observation. <laughs> like it didn't need to. Be like he's this not way. into it, but he's just like they do. <laughs> like, though. You have to look yeah. at it, right? Yeah, it's just factual. I remember. Uh, I don't know if you guys ever play MMOs, but there was always like you got made fun of your dude that played like a female character, like female blood elf or something, mm-hmm. and then their their response was always like, "Yeah, bro, because why would you want to look at a dude the whole time you're playing?" And it's like, "Damn, I'm. I guess I'm owned because yeah. now he thinks I'm gay and he's <laughs> yeah. <PK's> bad." <laughs> That was the the classic. I ran a girl in RuneScape because I thought I'd get a boyfriend. And and scam. Mm-hmm. Ooh. Oh, worry. that would have been tight. It turns out I can't flirt really well as a thirteen year old boy. <laughs> <laughs> you dare I say you can't yeah, flirt? And that's, well yeah, well, yeah, and that's yeah. changed. Yeah. As that you've grown never. Yeah. Well, oh, God, the, the, the Ludwig Bumble <laughs> even, coaching even through, oh. even through the screen of a thirteen year old MMO, your personality shine through, and they're like, no. Nah, 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 <laughs> I think I think a lot of thirteen year olds. Would, well, don't <laughs> go on. No, yeah. you, you I, just stop there because no, you're the money guy here. Okay. Hey, money guy. I think they. They. You think about your brother jerking off. All right. <laughs> uh, I think I have to pee pee poof. You have to go. Wait, I want to get. You have to I want to actually. I want to get you. I want to get you on one thing. That you're I'm an on the hour tail late. End of this. An it, hour or, late. Okay, you almost. I'm like, I'm like forty late. You want to touch it? You want to get in though? Get in on it. Yeah. Oh, that's hype. What is? Oh shit. Yeah, I'll get in on it. Yeah, this is good. Don't Can't worry. Sh- don't shut worry. The fuck up. Fuck okay. Up. Shut the fuck up. All right. I, all right. I guess Ludwig. <laughs> it's actually fine. Ludwig's doing part of the tattoo. I guess. Oh well. <laughs> hey, shut the fuck up. No, I won't say anything. Shut the fuck up. I'll, it's gonna be fine. Well, am I cool now? Can I be cool after this? Can or? you let the tattoo man do his job? Yeah, he's got blood on him. I'm he's got pro- blood on his sleeve. Is that I'm a professional? Dude. Yeah. <laughs> let he, me handle this. Okay. Yeah. No. All right. All right. Pick all right, this sweetheart. Up. Pick this guy up. Yeah, that guy. What uh, the? What? Make sure you're not blocking the PTZ. This one? Yep. Hold oh, on, yeah, hold on, hold on. Yeah. Go over here. Very good. All right. <laughs> no. So this guy, let's just leg over here. No, okay. hold on. Just like do the right leg. <laughs> uh, <laughs> just do the right leg. Uh, move over here. Oh, please don't yeah, fuck it up. This looks good. Yeah, get in there. Oh, this is needles. You, you can't mess it up. Either. All right, great, right, great. And which one are we going for? Here we go for the big hat. All right, all right. This is crazy. My tattoo, he says. <gasps> oh, you did it so thick! It looks good. It looks great. It looks great. <laughs> You're holding it fully wrong, but that's fine. More sideways. You You're think? holding like a kid holds a crayon. Yeah, that's what it is, dude. Don't, don't, don't do that. <laughs> get, get in there, dude. All right. That's so, terrible. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Tell me about your favorite time that you loved the world. <laughs> the only thing making this even remotely better is your hand directly on my nutsack. This is it's actually it's, it's yeah, really he, fucking getting in there and helping me feel like secure. Dude, he's getting a handful. <laughs> oh my god, bro! Yeah, dude. Well done. Well done. Well done. Best amateur tip. Thank you so much. <laughs> oh, this guy. I don't love you. Can't fuck this up because look. <laughs> you, probably, hey, you could. He could fuck it up. I'm that looks good. A part of you now. Yeah, I love that. You know, I tattooed him. The friendship. Yeah, I did a full tattoo on him That's once. Real yeah. This is what he did. <laughs> the ball is serious. Stick and poke. Someone actually said, "Isn't that the fairly odd parents?" And I was like, "True." Kind of, kind of right. legit. Gentlemen. Oh, it's like all right. Ludwig has to. Leave. Our listeners, I have to that. listen that for a business does. meeting. This we ran kind of late, but it, they will. Fin- they will wrap up. He's got to talk. Can I say who you're talking to? Can we have Yan replace the? Uh, actually, yeah. You- <laughs> the Yan cast. Yeah, can we bring Yan in here? Oh, Yan cast. No, Yan. This is the first Yan time. This is the first time. You don't want to do it. This is the first time Lud's right. ever bounced on a, a regular episode, a regular episode. He's got to go to a business meeting. I actually feel better now that he's gone. And now that I feel he's, like he can breathe. <laughs> now that safer. he's gone. Yeah, I feel safe. Have you guys, have you oh, guys, uh, this has been going around the past week. I didn't realize that this is like a, this is like came from TikTok. It's like fucking normie, normie world conversation starter, but it's fucking intriguing to me. And do you think there are more wheels or doors in the <laughs> don't world? Say, don't don't go. Oh, you look at it, <laughs> dude. <laughs> he did such a bad job. Yeah, look, oh. look at these. Look at these. Oh yeah, it's like a. It's like a. It doesn't look great. It's like an ABS system when your brakes like stop you from <laughs> skidding. No, that's not. That's not good. But, I mean, to be it, fair. He'll get better. It looks. He'll get better. It looks better. like a skid mark in underwear. I don't want to be his pig skin. Yeah, it'll be fine, dude. More wheels or doors? I wheels, one hundred percent. I I don't. Oh, are we doing this thing? I I, f- I feel like I said wheels too. Yeah, it's wheels. It's easy. It's wheels. Isn't a doorknob a wheel? That's the big argument. What? what? That is, oh, no. that's new. No. Why is it, that's new? Why is it an ontological argument now? No, it shouldn't go that way. We oh, just Mr. About... Fucking Doctor Mario <laughs> isn't a doctor. He, okay. You got dragged. No, no. So many people came to defend me, 
And there's so many arguments on my so, side too. Dude, fuck so, you. I, you I, got, tr- dude, I got everyone was no, like no, Nick's dog hey, down. Shut up. I got an entire paper written from a guy who wrote he's like I wrote a paper on this exact subject and you are correct. I also got that telling me people I was correct. My point is not that I'm right. My point is that I am not so wrong. It's not that absurd. Dr. Mario's a doctor. Done deal. What, what does he know? <laughs> <laughs> he did let a hey. he did let a guy tattoo. <laughs> Calm down. Yeah, okay, right. You're right. <laughs> Dr. Mario, I, he went to school. He got his medical. It's all good. Yeah, he has a PhD. <laughs> so is he so was, is Garfield. Yeah. He, he was trying to impress Peach. Yeah. And uh, he went to school four years. He's in You know that shit was for Daisy. You know that shit was. Peach didn't want that shit. He's an like OBGYN. Yeah, that's right. Dr. Mario taking a look. He's throwing those chlamydia pills. <laughs> Getting, it, getting his gloved hand up there. As someone who's had gonorrhea, that is about the size of the pill that oh, they give you. Oh, he's got Dr. Mario. Our boys right here. I will, I'll uh, hear oh, no oh, Dr. Right. Mario slander. We'll, we'll pick you two. Do you play on? Who do you play in Smash? Have we asked that question? Uh, Smash Brothers? No, like who do you pl- The video game? Yeah, like what character do you choose? Uh, fuck, man. I'm not good at Smash, so... I, okay, listen. When Smash came out uh, for the Switch, I told myself I was going to practice and get good. And... Um, it didn't happen. I just don't have the brain for it. Like, well, just who do you pick? Who's your? Uh, who do you draw to? I like I like Bowser Jr. and Villager. Okay. Wow. I like Bowser Jr. Those are some custom picks. That's a niche pick. Um, I I've won games. I feel like because people don't know what the fuck's going on. You know, like who is this character? Yeah, that that's the cannonball. only reason anyone wins. <laughs> okay. That's yeah, fair. in that game. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. No one who plays that game likes it or knows what's going on. I'm not having fun when I play it, man. To be honest. Like, yeah, you should play melee. Uh, I've heard. You should get into the GameCube title. It's pretty pretty raw. <laughs> mm. <clears throat> Wheels or doors? I my my real my real answer is when when there's like normy arguments about semantics in the world, I my brain wants to shut off and just like never never come back on. I don't even think it was a semantics that the intrigue was not from the semantics of it. You threw something new into the mix that I've never, I've never heard thought that. About. Yeah. yeah, that's I've never seen that point in the conversation ever because I think. The fun of it was like the the so many people confidently say doors out the gate, and then it's Why like do yeah. I feel like a doorknob can't be a wheel, right? Because like it doesn't even one rotate three hundred sixty degrees. It is not Fact. used to transport. I don't. I don't Big think facts. it counts. I don't think it. Counts. No, I think the wheels doesn't necessarily need to be a transported bikes. object. Bikes. Think about China. A gear. Think about China. Think is, about cars. Think it, about bikes. I was thinking it, about toys. Thinking about ve- ve- uh, vehicles. All ve- most vehicles will have four wheels. Some vehicles have four doors. Is right? a gear a wheel? Why are you doing this? I need. You're making this a No, game. I do think that's an important question. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> don't. I do think it don't is. Don't encourage this. Because, because like, for example, if we're gonna say that like the wheels on rollerblades are wheels, then we're we're already saying that like we're not only talking about car wheels. It's like, an actual wheel. There's different you... types of wheels. So are we? But, but like, but like the wheels on rollerblades are just rubber circles, if right? Some, if you if you took your watch to a watchmaker and he was like, I got to replace all these metal wheels, you'd be like, Give me my fucking watch back. <laughs> no, it's, look, no, that guy's hot. I do, think, <laughs> I do think words are very important, uh, and this is a this is a good argument. It's just Doctor Mario. The wheel's a wheel. You know what a wheel is. When you see a wheel, you know it. Did you see? You know. Did, I, I sent you I what. Uh, so so <laughs> Sam uh, in the Discord, my my friend, he med student. He's having a late night shift, but he doesn't have a lot to do because um, he's in the, uh, I, I think the OB unit. So he's like basically waiting for somebody to give birth and he has, doesn't have anything to do until somebody gives birth. He better get to work then. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You need, to, you need to drum up some activity in this in this hey, ring. Hey, one of you ladies get it going. <laughs> <laughs> and he's just like, if anybody has any, he does this in my channel in the Discord, by the way. I don't know why. He's like, if anybody has any questions about uh, you know, medical school or like the field right now that I can help answer for anybody that wants to go this route. Like, uh, just ask him in here. And then somebody like the fifth question is like, do you think Dr. Mario is a doctor? <laughs> and then he's like, as long as he over, over prescribes oxycodone, he's a real doctor in my yeah, book. That's fine. <laughs> Sam also, uh, what did he do? He fucking, I forgot. I love that guy. Does everybody here stream? Do you all stream on Twitch, YouTube? We I mean, don't. like, not not as a career. Like, yeah, we, just I like some, sometimes we put up casually. for fun, and uh, but like I would say I maybe streamed maybe three times total last year. Okay, he has streamed a lot recently, yeah. but more is he puts a T-shirt on his head and plays Valorant. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, and I yeah. scream and berate. I know it sounds weird. It's exactly what it sounds like. Okay, um, that's fair. I'm with it. And good, Aiden good goes live maybe once every three times, three times a year, right. and it's never put, the same thing. Put it this way. So this, it's uh, it's. Homeboy. Yeah, put it this way. He's a professional dancer, and we, we go out dancing sometimes. When you need the, yeah. the, the cash. This is our main thing. 
<laughs> this is the thing that the we podcast. all do. Yeah, the podcast. Six, six, yeah. Six, six. Okay, cool. Which is technic- technically makes us YouTubers, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't like that. I mean, okay. I don't want to oh, say that. It's a job. <laughs> well, the thing I've actually I realized this like so like um uh I think but by the way but your question I think we just go as long as you feel comfortable what just because I was we're still th- tattooing what I was wondering is like if this just cuts into the primo because we probably we're still gonna be going for a while right I mean do you want to just do the primo do you want to go into the primo and just do I it think here? we should do it tomorrow I okay. think we should do the primo. so we don't we just don't get to finish the tattoo in the episode why not. Well, how I'm, not, I'm down. No, to, I, we could just do a long episode. I'm yeah. just wondering it, how oh, no. we want it to cut up. I think we just go long episode. I think we just go long. Yeah, episode. me okay, too. Okay, cool. Okay. Um, Archie, so back, back. back. Um, <laughs> so one thing I realized was like uh, at the streamer awards was this was so many people. When was the streamer awards? Sorry, I didn't mean to cut Last you off. Last night. When did that happen? Last, Last night. night. Oh shit. Okay, so it's fresh. It's yeah, very, very fresh. fresh. Extremely. Yes. How was it, by the way? It was great. It was a really good. No, honestly, I yeah. It was a really good event. It, it's one of those events that uh, could have gone terribly and didn't. Uh, yeah. Our roommate, um, Ludwig's girlfriend, uh, she goes by that Cutie. She goes by Cutie online. Yeah, yeah. Um, she organized the entire thing, and uh, she was very strong. Oh, that's why she. That's why he won. Well, <laughs> that's the joke. Why, did, why didn't he just that say that? Why you know, it's funny. We we're, were in an Uber uh, the night before. I feel like you have to make him not win if you run the award show, right? Like just to the thing is, he, so he got voted fairly, and she was worried about it. Yeah, I mean, that's you, the thing. You, you would the, say yeah. that. Here's, here's the scoop. Here's the scoop. All you fucking, you worthless drones out there who fucking are getting mad on the internet. Here's the real scoop. Ludwig won because he made a video about it, and he also just won in a landslide in the voting system, and. It was a fucking pain in the ass once Cutie figured that out. Because she was like, I'm going to get shit for this. And it was like such a landslide that either you just say Ludwig didn't get it yeah. and just pick somebody else, which is weird, or you just let it ride. Make she was ineligible. she was joking. It. She literally joked about it when they closed it out. She's like, ah, I voted for XQC. Like, but but that there was truth in that. And that she really, she almost did not want him to win. Yeah. yeah. Loves to troll. So if they, if it's public knowledge that she runs the award show, they would just vote for that fool. It's it, here's it awkward, the thing. Right? There's tr- there's trolling, no, but he also uh, was the so he so he did a thing called a subathon uh, last year, which was he was live for an entire month without stopping, and he became the most sub to streamer on Twitch of all time. He had the highest sub count of all time, so he reached a pretty high height. So it makes sense that he won. Uh, but it was funny that you mentioned the whole uh, collusion thing because in his speech. He went on stage, and the first thing he said was like, "You wouldn't believe who I had to fuck to get here." Yeah, and uh, and that line came because we were driving home from the MV house in an Uber, and we're driving. He's like, he's not drunk, but he's like got some alcohol in him. He looks at me, he's like, "I think I'm gonna win," and I'm like, "You think so?" And he's like, "I think I'm gonna win," and I don't know what to say. And I'm, I'm like, he's like, "Here, let me let me run something by you." And he runs the worst speech ever by me. <laughs> and, yeah. and I listen. I'm like. No, that's bad. And I think for a second, I'm like, all right, you should go up and you should be like, you wouldn't believe who I had to fuck to get here. Okay. And he starts laughing. He's like, yeah, I'm gonna say that. So and that's a that's that's a nick. That yeah, that's a nick I usually I usually don't care to take the credit, but it was just funny that because he ran it, everyone laughed. And I'm like, thank God. He that told that landed. me we we were Ubering. By the way, we Ubered because Ludwig got my car towed. Oh, so we didn't even guys, mention that yet. Yeah. yeah. So my car currently impounded because Ludwig parked it at a place where you could only park it for an hour. Why for, bad things keep happening to you? It. No, it happens. <laughs> You'd be surprised. It just it's You're it, the sweetest person. Like it's, part, it's part of being from Canada. It's just like every story you tell is like how you get shit on. I hate it. It just <laughs> it makes me so sad. There's a, there's high, there's highs. He's a oh, he's a he's a day one yard fan. So sad. And then and then he changes yeah. into a charmeleon that and then you hear agrees how, with how me. hard we dice him up and you think it's pretty funny. <laughs> <laughs> but we were Ubering we were Ubering together because of that. And uh, he was like so. He was proud of that joke. He was like, he was telling me about it in the car. Isn't this so fucking funny? Nick gave me. This yeah, joke. yeah. He Nick did the same thing joke. to me, which yeah. is crazy because I was in the car when you gave that to him, just asleep. Yeah. So I'm. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, um, he was he was saying, "Fuck, what was I gonna? You you always do this. You always steal. You steal my energy from my eyeballs like a lizard. You yeah. took it from me. Yeah, like a lizard. You took my person. lizard we'll energy. Suck. Suck it out." Dude, so when Sear when Sear was saying all the streamers blink sideways, that was really funny. He was yeah, funny. that was that was really funny. I like that guy. Like that, guy. He's that, gro- that guy is grown on me. He played he played in a bit real well. Also, insane fits. Uh, <laughs> so we're uh, oh, I was on the way here this morning, and uh, I was talking uh to the girl that I brought to the streamer awards, and she was telling me this thing that had happened on Friday night with her and her friends. They went out uh to a bar, and it in this bar there's like packed people like mostly mostly like an older crowd but there's a group of these like young guys who look like around like 21 that are there 
And uh, this woman at the bar uh, just just like looks up, like looks over at like the group, the rest of the bar, and is like, "Does anybody want any breast milk right now?" <laughs> <laughs> Serve that shit up and <laughs> round, full round on me. And Ice and no cold. one, no one says anything during COVID. Yeah, yeah, the audacity. Yeah, it's more of a pre-COVID activity, if you ask me. <laughs> uh, and she, I'm trying, she, to, I'm, I'm trying to do fucking belly button shots. <laughs> <I'm> just, <laughs> breast milk out of the trusty dude. Uh, and then, and then she, uh, no, like no one takes her tit out and begins to squeeze and <gasps> squirt wow. breast milk across like it, the bar. Like it's the no! gather- like it's a <laughs> gathering of the juggalos. These these <laughs> three these three 21-year-old boys are covered in breast milk. <laughs> no way. They 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 I'm so jealous. Losing their fucking minds <laughs> laughing and her friend her friend dead ass looks at at uh at my date and is like she does this every weekend. <laughs> Dude, no. I'm so jealous. <laughs> How? That's How do you a, do it every weekend? You'll never be the person in a group that has the worst story. You will have the best story every time for the rest of your fucking life. Dude, you get... I, I think it's Cap. I think it's Cap. She does this every weekend because <laughs> it might be you can't Cap. always just have breast milk. Wait, yes, you can. Yes, you really? can. Yeah, yeah, you can. Totally. The, once again, Slime fails to understand female anatomy. <laughs> <laughs> if there's one thing I know, dude, yeah. it's breast milk. <laughs> it's breast milk. <laughs> You have any que- if you have any questions about breast milk. That's your two okay. things. It's yeah. Garfield and breast milk. I know, they, I know two things. They told me this with a rather <laughs> underwhelming delivery. Yeah, they're, bored of, they're bored of it. Yeah, and I was like, you know, like, you know how fucking insane this sounds, right? Like, every bit of this sounds like you fucking made it up while you were fucking high. Yeah. And uh, no, this just all played out in a bar in Los Angeles on Friday night. Man. Yeah. I if a per, if they got facial hair, it's like in their beard, like <laughs> yeah. a fucking Just like milk ripping. mustache. Yeah, they got, they, need a, they need a splash zone sign. At <laughs> Can that you place. imagine like your pants is like, oh, did you <laughs> did you pee your pants, dude? It's, it's like, like no, it's like, a woman's no, breast. It's like, no, it's, her breast it's milk like, on me. Yeah, yeah, I peed my pants. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Can I just get my coffee and go? <laughs> <laughs> no cream. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no cream. Babe. Don't leave room. Yeah, I don't. I I've never had breast milk. You're dating someone, and no, you, 100% you not. broke edge. That is a good question because cruelty free. Vegan being vegan is about the ethics of it, but yeah. humans you, are I mean, consent. Can you swallow cum? Yeah, but that's not a food. Yeah, breast milk. You breast milk is a. <laughs> oh, but isn't vegan just any animal product? So you could presumably could we're not animals consume we're animals. Like we're primates. Mm. You know what I mean? But it's breast milk's for us. I, that's what I'm saying. For the boys. If you're vegan out there in <laughs> out, out there in the it's universe. For us. <laughs> breast milk is for the boys. Yes, it's for- oh, BM? That shit's for the boys. <laughs> I'm trying to go and full I, I'm trying to go full send on I've been a, on a that. <laughs> I feel like I can see him at the like the vegan offices like arguing for his license back. No, breast milk is for us. Yeah. Can yeah. you imagine can It's you, a schism? Can you imagine that that woman like maybe maybe she has like a posse of male friends and they're like is Susan bringing her pump tonight? <laughs> Yo, what's up? I'm Frile. Yeah, we got oat, <laughs> almond, breast. We got cashew. It's like, wait, what was that third option? Oh, almond? Yo, yeah, that shit's great. Yo, what did you eat yesterday? <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo, your breast milk is stinky. Tonight. <laughs> <laughs> you eat some garlic. <laughs> Artisanal breast milk. <laughs> no, dude. More savory. <laughs> Oh, oh I, are you a sweet or savory breast milk person? <laughs> I was reading, I was reading comments uh, last week. One of them was like, because we were talking about chiropractors, and a lot of people chimed in. Like chiropractors, actually, they like do a lot of schooling and like they're legit. I'm I was like, saying okay, they weren't doctors. Cool, sorry. Like, uh, if Mario's not a doctor. Chiropractors aren't fucking doctors. On God, that's what I'm saying. And then, and then, so, <laughs> so there were there was this one guy in the comment section. He was like. Honestly, being a, a medical doctor in America is is LMAO like so stupid and easy. Not in a real country like Germany. If you were in a country like Germany, it was a really insane comment. What a take! Yeah, it was like it was like I think you're the only guy that thinks like this. Yeah, because this is because like we live in a country where it's like uh, like getting shot in the chest is like hello. So <laughs> yeah, so it's weird that to say that doctors have it easier because you just like part of your life is just dealing with people with like who look like SpongeBob. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> and uh, and I was like, that's such an interesting take, because because uh, we were also talking about the idea of like you're a PhD doctor, 
but yeah. people still call you doctor. Yeah, it's interesting, like a guy beating off in a in, in a sewer somewhere. <laughs> like you look at it and you're like, "This is crazy." You're like, "That's crazy." You do that, and he's like, "Yeah." You, you don't look intelligent down there, but I do want to keep watching. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> do, you, do, do you leave the sewer after? What, what do you do? <laughs> do, you ever, do you ever do it in the sink? <laughs> hey, not too check. How are we looking, boys? That shit looks fucking fire. Half, that looks good. Yeah. Hell yeah. Bro. Wait, do you guys jack off in the sink? <laughs> no. Sorry, he, uh, Brandon he, asked if we jack off in the sink. He jacks off in the in the into the toilet. Yeah, no, that's a smart move. You yeah. do do you yeah, do you that? Just flush it, yeah. Okay, you guys are the same. Maturity. Oh, grow up. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I don't that's tell what I'm to saying. grow up. I'm, I'm not with trying you. to Oh, you think I want a fucking sock? Uh, God, did I ever tell you guys about the, the guy with the mirror? Yes. Okay. Yeah, you, you talk about that on the, the pod. podcast. Yeah, yeah. That was crazy. That is the craziest person you've ever brought up to me. Yeah. Maybe reca- small recap, just in case. Small recap. Hasn't seen the hanging out at my friend's house. He uh he has this mirror in his room. It's like a fucking standing floor mirror, and there's these white streaks all going all over it. And I'm so we're hanging out in his room. It's the first time I've been over to his house, and I was like, "What's all that? Did you like spill milk and cereal on your mirror or something?" He's like, and he, with, with the most casual casual tone, he's like, "Oh no, I I beat off onto that." And I'm like, what? And he's like, I, yeah, yeah. Well, I, I jerk off on my bed where you're sitting, and then I stand up when I'm about to bust, and I bust onto the onto that mirror. And I'm like, that's that's really gross, dude. And then he gets kind of self conscious, like, really? <laughs> <laughs> and then years years later, yeah. he just sends me like random uh, like, do you believe in Christ messages on Facebook? So <laughs> that all checks out. Yeah, yeah that's, that's kind of where that ends up. Guilt. <laughs> Guilt. Yeah, he's thinking about the mirror. The mirror uh, is him. But to be fair, if you jack off in the sink, you're probably in front of a mirror as well. That's kind of fucking weird. A bathroom sink. Bathrooms have mirrors, but but a kitchen sink. Yeah. You jack off in the kitchen. I always imagine. I not always personally, at, not as someone who's done That's this. Like a lug, lug I always thing. imagined it to <laughs> be the kitchen sink. You bust, in, you bust in the kitchen sink. You bust in real life. <laughs> If you're jacking they, off in the they bathroom, they like that one. They like that one. <laughs> What's up? If you're jacking off in the bathroom, there's a mirror right in front of you. You're making eye contact. Yeah, probably. but the thing is, like, it's not busting on. You know what? This guy was a prison of his own cum inside a prison <laughs> because the white streaks <laughs> <He> created <laughs> bars, and he saw himself he, trapped he in his in, own lust. He lived, no in, he lived in Superman's home, but that no, shit was all cum. No, no one said that. <laughs> no one has said that <laughs> ever. <laughs> the forge is a solid dude. <laughs> <laughs> So wait, you're gonna go climbing later? Is that cool with a tattoo? Oh, or can I it... go climbing? I didn't think about that at all. I don't give a shit. Do you have like that fucking like second skin to put on it or something? The sanaderm. Oh shit! No sanaderm for I you. Wear, I wear long pants when I climb. It'll be chill. Yeah. Yeah. It'll don't, hurt. Just don't get Garfield. Don't get him scuffed. He needs the lasagne. Oh, the lasagne. You know what I'm saying, dog? Yeah. My wife. My wife. Alrighty. Uh, I had a buddy that jacked off in the trash can. Say that again. I had a homie that jacks off in the trash can. I guess that's, again, that's pretty, I why that's, did he do that? Well, it's like toilet, but I guess more environmentally conscious. It wasn't like a single event. Butter. It's what he does. I'm trying to bust in the in the trash can's butt. You know what I mean? <laughs> the trussy. Yeah. The, the, the yeah, the, yeah, if the you trussy. Yeah. If you're so a Ludwig, by the way, has a hole in his chest. He has pectus excavatum. Uh, it's like a Harry Potter thing. And I, have, I have a <laughs> small version of that. Yeah, I got a little cave. Oh, yeah, chest hole? Yeah, really? yeah, so we call it his chussy, his chest pussy. Yeah, he eats uh, cereal out of it and shit. Yeah, we, we, yeah, have, yeah. We, we, we do like, like, we've seen people do like vodka shots out of his and stuff. Yeah. So That's tight. Uh, it's pretty tight. Yeah, we make fun of him all the time. Because he's heartless, dude. Just a chasm of empty. Yeah. Oh, it, you That's wouldn't why- believe. You That's why he doesn't feel like we do. He doesn't feel <gasps> like we do. That's a really good point. Yeah, trauma happens in his life and he's kind of just like, all right, well, I'm, when am I going live? Yeah. Oh. I don't know what to do about it. I don't want to judge him too harshly because I don't know him. Something happens to that man, and I'm worried. <laughs> That's what we we're trying to talk figure about out. that all the time. And I'm glad he's not here because we can actually just discuss it. I wish he was here so we can do some healing. No, you would think that would happen, but it doesn't. It yeah. doesn't happen. No, you actually he sh- won't you, heal you, with you. You stray further from God every time you try. It, it, it's like looking into the abyss. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You get you become a worse person by interacting every day. You're just a little worse. A hundred percent. Like, I feel like every time I try to break through to him, I'm like, bro, just like tell have, me, like, have, what's going on? He's have you ever like, watched Full Metal Alchemist? <laughs> you know, you know when they go to like the void and that door opens up and there's that little faceless white guy there. Yes, that's. I think that guy's inside Ludwig. <laughs> <laughs> He's the guy that gives you your fucking alchemy powers. Yeah, 
thick. Yeah. I, I don't get the reference at all, but Zipper liked it a lot, too. <laughs> so this must be really hidden. I could feel Ludwig turning his daughter and dog into some kind of chimera. I know that nice. one. And just being like, it's science, bro. Yeah. No, it's content. Look at, look at the yeah. stream numbers. It's I made it. It's my one out of ten. It's my one out of ten. Yeah. Put her on stream. Put her. Get her on camera. <laughs> It's pog tent, is what he'd say. I, uh, when we were talking about the streamer awards earlier, I was thinking about a conversation I had uh, last night. Because I think going into this event, and I was thinking about when Cutie initially said she wanted to do this, my expectation, based on everything that Cutie's accomplished, is that she's gonna yes. she's gonna do this. Like it'll be good. It like anything she like puts her mind to. I feel like she like what the you, execution. Well, is I usually... what he's laughing about real quick. What do you laugh? What are you, what are you giggling about over here? My streamer name's Handsome. <laughs> <laughs> well, the full one's Cutie Cinderella, that's, which that, so, oh, that's a lot better. So yeah, there's yeah. like, yeah, but yeah, mine's you know, handsome for short. Prince. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm cute, handsome. Yeah, yeah, mine's Prince Charming. Uh, so <laughs> handsome Prince Charming. I'm glad Ludwood found someone. Yeah, <laughs> I'm glad he's happy. <laughs> We're happy too. And uh, I I figured this project like would come together kind of like the other thing she did, where like it would be really good and people would talk about it, but it would sort of have that like little scuffed edge to it. In in uh, in like a good way, whereas like I think the roast didn't feel like it was on like like pure television. It still felt like it was grounded in Twitch. Yeah, yeah. But then this whole event like was beyond my expectations in like every single way. Like it was so fucking amazing, and she literally took a concept that I think is so lame normally, like and so corporatized, and turned it into this really authentic and cool event that was fun to be at fun to watch online like so well produced it, and she could literally she could quit streaming today now that she has this proof of proof of concept she could quit streaming today and do this one event full time don't tell her that she fucking hates streaming brother she might just do she might just yeah. dead ass do it she could do this sheesh, bro. Yeah. Sheesh, i think boy. she actually i think she actually changed something in the industry last night yeah, I think that I think Wait, there hasn't been a streaming like a, a award show for streamers. There has, not, it's there just, has, but they're really bad. They're really bad. Oh, okay, they're okay. not like there's no care really put into them. They're just kind of knockoffs of like actual cool things. It's and this big, was a very unique thing. Big, big money and like companies behind them that are very removed from the culture of the space. So they wind up like doing the, the winners that are, are always people. You're like, the, what? Like, how did they win? Why the fuck are those people nominated? Like, it just doesn't make any sense. So she, her idea behind this project was, hey. I will plan as a streamer who knows all these people personally, who has a way better feel for like how this all works and, and can what also people get actually them want, to show up. and can get them to show up. That a I will host it instead. Oh, for yeah. sure. They and she they fucking like she fucking did it, and I think exceeded all expectations. And I, I, it was it's kind of like I I think she got a little lowballed from my understanding on like sponsorships and stuff this year. Yeah, which is. I guess kind of understandable. First event that's very common. It hasn't happened yet, right? But now that this dude, now you can that sell big hey, on it now. By the way, almost hit 400k concurrence. Uh, was over 300k for What's almost up, the whole Nabisco? broadcast. Yeah, fucking hey, ships ahoy. Hey, Nestle. <laughs> it was also really funny seeing. Like, Shoot the, me some fucking water bottle. Seeing money. like the ad reads, like the first ad read that she did for that like fucking shark, whatever. I don't care. We're not sponsored by them. Uh, <laughs> uh, she she was like it was like the most eloquent ad read I have literally ever heard. I was like, oh my god, they they are lucky. That they are doing an ad beat this good because the crowd's pumping up and cheering for them and shit and like Me. all this stuff and then and then the rest of them as the show became more and more successful and like was going good and the viewers were high she was just like I don't fucking know there's some shit uh, fucking VPN whatever and like yeah. move on. Well, I kept laughing during that one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, what's so, so funny? funny? Yeah. Wait, me and Germa every time there was a sponsor readout we started clapping really loud. Because yeah. we know what the fuck we the know bags, how that, we know how that bags. shit be. But that was the thing. I don't I, I don't actually know. I haven't talked to QD about this at all. But I think they weren't actually getting the bag, you know? That's no, they the weren't. But that's but, the unfortunate But part. you got to be hyped Next about one. it. Next one. You're gonna oh, 100%. Sure. Yeah. The first one is like, look at look at how popular this is. The second one is when you fuck them. Yeah, you fuck them good. Yeah, you fuck them real good, well, real nice. But, well, back in, uh, in BTS times, when we were there, it was like, wait, what we found was that Ken, Ken would tell, so he would tell the, the talent at like Smash Summit or something, he's like, listen, these companies that like, if we do a sponsored tweet and it gets like, any sort of uh, like traction like like 50 likes or something it's a big deal it's a big deal and the people there freak out and they're like oh my god it was a huge success so literally like just telling the fans like hey i know it's fucking cringe i know you hate doing this if you like and retweet that shit it, it goes a fucking your your country mile so just do it yeah if you're sitting at home especially for a game like melee that's not getting a lot of sponsor bread typically uh, all you have to do is click like, and that goes a yeah. long way. If, and this is, and to 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 counter this, to, to to remain neutral, if you don't give a shit, block the brand. 
like that that you can also you can act against the interests of the event that you don't want to support by for one not watching it you dumbass we're, piece of we're shit. We're weaponizing the viewers. I'm just saying it's like your your I love this. Your eyeball and your click is literally your entire value. So if you withhold that, then they suffer. So figure it out. That or was, stop complaining. That was my last battle with the last ultimate summit I worked on cuz people some people were not very many people, but some people were complaining about like how it was put together and like why this was done this way, why this was done this way and I was like, "Great, if you want to see change, I trust that you will not be tuning in this weekend as, a, <laughs> as your vote." In in opposition That's to the right. event being and run there, this and, way, yeah. and then the dude is like, "Well, I'm still gonna, you know, I'm, this I'm is, still this gonna is, watch an ad." This is dead ass the vine from fucking 2014. That guy who's just like, "Yo, fuck school." <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna still go though. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's, it's just, the yeah. same shit. They're yeah. all weak as fuck. <laughs> yeah, you it, that. So if you ever wanted insight, it's ra- it's actually that simple. Withhold what you have, you which is an eyeball and a, and a v- finger. Vote with money, man. Yeah. Um, so yeah, it was, it's kind of interesting. I was, <laughs> I was kind of worried coming up to it cause cutie was like, she, she made that tweet. She was like, oh, I was up for like eight hours doing seating arrangements. Yeah. And in my head, I'm like, you, I definitely feel that there is something more important to, <laughs> to focus on. Yeah. There has to be. I was worried about <laughs> the production aspect. That was like the biggest thing for me is when I thought about what could go wrong, what is like most dependent, like m- most heavily affects the success of the show is production and, and I, when I, heard, I hadn't heard her like talk about production very yeah. much so i was like well when i heard it was the germa dollhouse crew i was like they yeah got, i, I did fine. have a lot of faith because of the team yeah there's it, faith so. there. but there, there's also like i don't know sometimes shit just goes wrong but germa apparently the guy who runs that operation that production he's like his really old friend oh, mm-hmm. i didn't know that they're really tight yeah that's dope. and that's why when he went up um it was like German was like freaking out. He's like, yeah, best in the business. And yeah. then in my ear, so I had actually had an ear earpiece and I was talking to a TD mm-hmm. for like throws. We all had a camera guy and a PA. Yeah. And we had a TD in our ear, which was really good. Yeah. It was like for all the problems that they had and as far as like coordinating people coming to us for interviews, it was uh, it was really professional. And the guy's in my ear and I'm like, all right, who's my TD? What's your name? <laughs> it's like it's like mission control. Yeah, yeah. And, and if you want to ever... Yeah, it, yeah, it, they're literally called the chair. I like yeah. when you call them the Matrix. I thought that was funny. <laughs> the Matrix in the too. If you ever want to, if you're a talent out there and you want to bond with whoever's running a production, ask who the TD is, which stands for technical director, and they'll be like, okay, this guy knows what's up, and he's our friend. Yeah, you know? and yeah. <laughs> I do like it. there. I was watching JHB do his interviews, right? And he couldn't. Uh, he couldn't. And to be fair, I do think this is like a difficult skill to develop. He couldn't do the interviews and listen at the same time. It's hard. Yeah. And so he would like any time you could tell he would just stop mid sentence like <laughs> when he was interviewing somebody and then Dude, it's like oh sorry my favorite JHB ism from his interviews was he would ask a question but then he would react to their answer as if it went along with whatever the premise was oh no matter what God. they said so like for example he'd be like are you excited to be here and they'd be like um like no not really or whatever and he'd be like yeah I'm excited too uh and and <laughs> and, and, and like because he had to say the next thing that he planned otherwise he couldn't riff. Like he was like in a, he was so nervous he was like unable to riff so he had one planned response and no matter what they said he just responded with it and I was watching I'm like this is actually maybe funnier than if he would have re- yeah, reacted yeah you just keep you stay on rails baby yeah exactly yeah <laughs> I, this I, isn't a choose your own adventure book yeah, yeah. <laughs> stick to the script or I will <laughs> I watched and I was like this shit it's still endearing I still enjoyed it what the the awkward interviews yeah. JHP's interviews. Yeah, it's just a gimmick, and it's like you can only run a gimmick for so long before yeah. you know. I I thought I cannot believe, dynamic. dude. I cannot believe Nim got on stage oh. and then plugged his fucking Twitter. Okay, look, I'm not gonna start, set, I'm not gonna start beef. Stigma, grind set. But I'm starting beef on the podcast. Yeah, oh, I did shit. not like when that guy was talking. Oh really? I thought he was. I thought he was bad at that shit. I thought he was bad too, but not in like a hostile I'm way. I'm sure he's a great guy and fun to be around and a great creator, but I thought he sucked at that. <laughs> and and when he went up and he was like, I'm almost at 100K followers. So, I mean, there's 300 people, 300,000 people. I yeah. was like, shut up. I was like, that's crazy. Shut that up. You're saying it that. was look, pretty cringe. Look, I know it's going to get it. sent to him. I know it's gonna, the whole thing's going to happen. That's okay. Nim, you're great. I'd love to meet you. Let's talk. Let's get coffee. That's totally fine. <laughs> However, I was mad. I thought that was lame. Yeah. That's okay. We what? can be different. Uh, you know what? I also yeah, it, it, he, it it's completely made up for by the fact that how fucking funny he was the whole night. But when Seer got on stage to read nominees and he mispronounced Ebai's name, I'm like, that's the fucking goat. Yeah. How about you pay respect? Yeah. You know how many more viewers he gets? You're than like everybody oh, in this fucking room. Uh, what's his name? Mungo? I I don't know. Dude, I didn't know about Bloom World Championship. 
That shit was tight. Dude, oh yes. my god. That that event had like you close to shit? I think it had like the same viewership as the streamer awards. Have you heard about the Balloon World the World is it called that's what's called Balloon World Championship? I don't I haven't yeah. seen shit. Yeah, okay, so ever. this, like this, this Balloon World this, he's he's from Spain, yeah? Yeah. Okay, so he started a, a a sport where it's just keeping a balloon up, a helium balloon up in a room full of furniture, but it's like a competitive sport that like inter, is internationally uh competed in and he made this enormous event. And I was watching it for the first time at the awards because they showed footage. And I was yeah. like, oh my God, this is amazing. It was so entertaining. This is competitive. Can, yes. I, can I ask you, um, like, I know like maybe three streamers and you tell me if you know them in person, if you yeah. think they're cool. <laughs> think about uh, Myth. Myth is yeah, myth awesome. Yeah, Myth is awesome. We he love was at our house for we the Super Bowl. Myth. He's a sweetheart. He's super fun to be around. Um, he, he, can, seems, he, he seems cool. He can, he, 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 oh, wait, he said this to me. So we we found out because he said this on a stream uh, like last week that he uh, has, has able to successfully suck his own penis. Basically. Yeah, he told us that. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's and then, so impressive. Dude. Yeah, it is impressive. I'm so and jealous. I, but I talked to him and I was like, I, he's like, I can't do it anymore. That's the uh, thing. And I'm like, ooh. Is it better to have loved and lost? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> dude, it's like Space Jam. <laughs> and, or, and I was like, not at all. And I was like, you're just too juicy now. That's a would problem. you rather be born blind or slowly go blind? That's right. Yeah, to see the beauty of the world before it goes. Yeah, away. I just want to do it once. <laughs> Uh yeah, so he's awesome. I also learned last night. I was I had a film camera. I was carrying around at the event, and he was like, "Oh shit, are you into film?" He's like, "I recently got into like film photography." I'm like, so we talked about it for a little bit. And I was like, "You are now even more interesting to me Aww. than you were before." Mm-hmm. He's a really great. I, guy. Uh, once again, I, I found him through Elden Ring. So basically, if I get addicted to a game, I'll yeah, go, I'll I mean, go that, on. That literally, everyone. I'll go on Twitch, browse the game I'm playing, see who's playing it. He's terrible at it, but he had a good time. He had a good attitude about it. Yeah. You know, if Ludwig good. was still on Twitch. He might have seen Ludwig. It's possible, yeah. Ludwig streamed Elden Ring for five no, days I, straight. I think I've seen that dude before, but well, it, he was streaming Elden Ring for five days straight, and then I was, like, I was playing like, for five days you straight. We just missed. It. We just yeah, missed. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, Chips yeah. in the night. Chips in the night. <laughs> exactly. uh, I think uh, you, you're you're like a you're a good insight because I feel like this is the reason variety streamers exist is because they want to capitalize on the people who are interested in the new game, not who already know who well, they are. Well, I watch I watch Hassan. Like that's the homie. Oh really? Hassan. Oh yeah. Also the homie. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> That's bad. That you saw Hassan bash a child's head in with a brick, and I'd be like, I don't believe you. <laughs> I'd be like, I don't, I don't care. And it's that's fine. The, yeah. That's and the it's fine. Uh, this is the new leftist movement. <laughs> yeah. I support. Is he, is he rich? I bet that kid was a fucking capitalist pig. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, who's uh, who's your next guy? Your next next uh, streamer you like? Have you hung out with Hassan before? Is he yeah, yeah. yeah. He's been to our yeah. house. Yeah. I'd, I'd say we were all like good friends with Hassan. Hassan is jealous of us because we are a, a system that makes Ludwig like be able to do the things he does. He's like Ludwig fucking just surrounds himself with like people that are more talented than him, and I don't have that, and it pisses me off. I agree, yeah, he, I, I agree with that statement. I was talking, <laughs> I, I was talking to him uh, about that after the Stavros show a bit, and he's like, "Yeah, I just got Will." <laughs> and then, and which, Will, which I'll say, and then jo- a hitter. Will, <laughs> and, a hitter. Then, and then he was like, and then Will like went and did his own career instead That's of like true. helping yeah. me. <laughs> Years ago, uh, Hassan had some some people on. I don't know who the fuck they were, but um, he introduced them as uh, this person sells farts in a jar. Amaranth. Yeah, she we had her on our podcast. Also, um, also a homie. And the other person was um, I don't remember, but I I typed in chat just you know casually. I was like, man, you need some black friends. <laughs> and I got I got timed out chat for twenty four hours. Get that ass banned. You know what? You know what? You're right. By the way. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't like a diss it was like an offer i'm like bro i'll, oh, I'll be the guy know, that made you it, that, need it, you that, need we it. can get you involved that made it even worse because i was like hey bro like you don't have to hang out with people that sell farts in jars and they're like banned like, <laughs> i'll say look to, to come to come to come to amaranth's defense who's selling the farts no, in the jars. No, nothing against dude you hey listen you gotta do what you gotta do to live if i could sell farts in a jar i wouldn't be doing a fucking garfield tattoo Am- amaranth <laughs> who's, who's making over a million dollars a month uh also our friend very, very intelligent, very smart, very funny, super driven, very great person. Uh, also gets that shit fucking canned up and impressed at your door, American factory made. Like a goddamn Look, from like, farm to table. She, like, o- she owns now, the means of production too. Which that, yes. I, I, here's I, the question: I'm a, I'm a big fan of. You is know? that is that vegan? Oh, are we? Are is you that a eating ve- it? Is that a vegan product? You're huffing it. Come on. Our uh, cigarettes are vegan, huh? You're not. That's hard. It's not. It's not like when you go to Knott's Berry Farm and get the gold in the little canister. It's like you're popping it open. You're seeing what's up. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> you know what? We should have beat her to the punch. You know she that. sent us jars. No. Yeah. No I, way. I, 
So no, we, they're not there yet. But I uh, I saw her at the streamer awards, and I I came up with like I was hey I gave her a hug, and I was, I was like um how you doing? She's like she immediately goes, do you get your jars? Oh, she's hype on yeah, it. Yeah, she's hype. She's like, get your jars, and then she talks to her assistant. Did they get their jars? <laughs> and and then she, and she's like, we sent them, we sent them. And I'm like, look, I'm patiently waiting for the jars. I I don't know if I'm gonna open mine. Did I think you? I'm gonna keep it. Can I pitch you something just real quick. Absolutely. Just a fucking unboxing. Oh, dude. <laughs> um, we could do a jar Please on do yeah, an yeah, unboxing the podcast. Yeah. Open and you're just like. Like please, I kind of, please, I kinda please, want please, it. please. Watermelon. It, it makes the uh, AIM signing online noise. It's like, <laughs> <laughs> it's like. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was wondering, did you, uh, did Slime meet uh, Morgan, her manager, last night? No, I didn't even get to say hi to Amber. She's, she's excellent. Morgan, she's cool. Morgan was super cool, and she wanted to meet you because she was like, he's, he's like me. He yeah. understands. Abby, who like, is Point Crow's manager, was the same way. Yeah. Like we yeah. all, we all have this like. This shared connection of like being the every the P- atlas of these people. <laughs> every PA has a deep set trauma that for, that that they can only share with each other. Yeah, like there's some there was some layer of that that like Morgan just couldn't explain to me. That's that right. I couldn't relate. to. And you know what? We, with Abby, I went up to her. She immediately, we immediately started talking, yeah. and then we like within five minutes we're both swapping anecdotes about like. How fucking stupid the person oh, we yeah, work for yeah. is, yeah. and we're just like we're just like melting. Like, thank God someone sees me. In yeah. this somebody, world. We were sharing at the Envy the Envy House. We were sending um we were sharing screenshots of like I'm like this is what Ludwig says. And yeah. It's like isn't this like not English? And they're like oh wow. Well, this is what Point Crow said to me. And we're like literally sharing it back and forth. And like they're just there and they're just like guys like right <laughs> yeah, yeah. we're like right here. No, it's like just shut the fuck up. <laughs> yeah, our shut time up. Now. We're making fun of you. Shut up. <laughs> Point Crow, very funny. Point Crow's great. Yeah. Super funny guy. Oh. Love that guy. Eric, man, I'll even say it. I'll say Eric, the homie. Yeah, I'll He's give not him a point first crow name. Me anymore, Eric. That's... I'll say Eric is better than Point Crow. I think I. I don't think I want to call him Point Crow. It is a ba- it's, it's a mouthful. It's like, uh, it's like a. It's you know, no slime. Yeah, it's, it's no slime. That's right. Yeah. Clean. Yes, to the sir. point. That's right. I'll say my my card at this award show last night said envy on it. Mm-hmm. Um, I think that's probably my fault. I think. Oh wait, what's your streaming name? What's your uh, what name do you go by? Envy is what I used when I competed in Smash Bros. Um, which a lot of people thought was because I liked the anime Full Metal Alchemist. Um, has nothing to do with that actually. Uh, it's my initials N V. How do you feel about anime uh, in general? You seem you seem you said it with a little bit of distaste. You're saying the tag? You said you said anime like a slur. Um, it is a slur, and I think people who watch it are inherently bad people. Well, actually, do you watch you watch anime, right? Can you take a break from this for one that one moment? Can you play me in rock paper scissors? Yes. Okay. I'm just gonna. Just, yeah, I just want to see. I'm gonna big... throw a rock though. Okay. <laughs> you, I love that. That's the Ludwig show. I love you that. say I'm throwing rock. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Ludwig does every time. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it, rock, is it paper, on shoot? scissors. So every single oh, person yeah, yeah, in the world you. who watches anime uses scissors first. This is my this is my theory, and I've been telling this to everyone. It's never failed ever. So yeah. I want you to know that I have one what? completely psychoanalyzed you, <laughs> and two was right about that. Uh, and I want you, in the rest of your life, I want you to carry that feeling and wonder, like, you know, what do I know? I'll forget, I'll forget this day <laughs> by tomorrow. Trust me, dude, you, have, you have become a data point. That's, I have, the, that's the, I have the memory of a goldfish, dude. I'm going to, I'm not going to remember this at all. I'm glad you're recording so I can, like, I would like go back and visit. I would are like you, to are keep you jumping the, back in? You jumping back in? I, I want to keep that. the pressure on. I want to keep the pressure on. Are you circumcised? Yeah. Let's, Let's go. go. So we're split down the middle. So they two aren't, we two are. I don't want to be rude, but you kind of got a dumpy, dude. Me? Yeah, Aww. you're kind of thick, dude. Aww. I appreciate you saying that. My ego got shattered yesterday. I saw you walk away, and I was like, "Fuck!" <laughs> like for real? Just I'll love to watch just it. On a, on a love, Sunday, bro. I you're love that. You're coming back up. <laughs> Caked up like I that. I had fuck. an ass off yesterday, and I lost. Yeah, the ass off. You lost the ass off? I didn't to, get to watch the video yet. Point Crow's Point Caked Crow, up, dude. He popped his no, ass out, dude. and it was like too pumpy. Dude, like yep. he knows how to pose, and he had good pants. And I dead ass when you said ass off, I was gonna pull down my fucking. Pants. Show the re- dude. I think you might reel the real ass. Off. You might win the real. That's ass what off. I was. Then that's what I wanted and to I've, do. I've I don't know, ch- dude. His no, ass you know was what? crazy. Looking. You know what? I've seen your cheeks. I've seen your cheeks. And I know what you're working with, uh-huh. and I think it's beautiful. And I think that I don't think that he can hold a candle to what you. That's have. what I was thinking. But then I was like, damn, there are strangers afoot. This is assault. Yeah, you can't just do it. No, you, I, I w- you have my permission to show ass if you want. Do you want to see my I'm ass? I would, lo- I would love to see the ass. Okay. Actually, fucking okay. So read it. Read it. One out of ten. <laughs> Don't go full. I hate when you do this. Yeah, and close your eyes. This. Yeah, and close your eyes. Yeah, You're not ready your for this. It's yet. not for you. Oh, oh, god damn, brother! Do you shave your ass? No, that's <laughs> he just the beauty. Has no body that's hair. the beauty. He's no that's body what he's hair. just like all the time. <laughs> yes. It was just sculpted. Hair on it was sculpted in my marble. Legs or my you, ass. Have, you have hair in the place I want hair. You have no hair in the place I don't want it. You're you're follically blessed, he's bro. The like, 
You're the like the, man. the god of hair has come down and smiled well, upon you. Well, you know what my curse is. You're unlikable. No. He has the same as you. Oh, you're a chussy brother. Hit it. Oh, yeah, the little. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. This is me. Well, the thing is, just get a tattooed, bro. You'll look sick. Wait, do you have a tattoo? Yeah, I Can I see it? Yes. Yes, please. Oh, oh I'll, I'll lift your shirt. <laughs> you don't mind? Oh, oh shit. Oh, that is badass. You barely have a chussy. If he has it, he oh, has shit. it. All right. Don't yeah. gatekeep. He, he just has pecs. That's the thing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he just has muscles, too. It's exercise, a bummer. Exercise once. Get tattooed. Exercise once. <laughs> just it, one time. It's to. actually one bench press in push-up. Just a lot of weight. Just do a uh, really heavy weight one time. Yeah. yeah. It's really <laughs> well, good for great. you. That's great. That's great. Oh, fuck. What were you just saying? I, was, I had something to say. Fuck. Can't remember. Fuck. Think butts. Probably the nicest dude Nuts. butt I've ever the seen. ass off. I appreciate it's that. It's a great butt. Yeah. We we're all fans at the house. You know what? And hair is a deal breaker. So if, his, if he is like the nicest ass, but it's hairy. Oh, that's what I was going to say. So you know, you know what, Point Crow? Oh, wait. Maybe I can't leak this. What? I don't know if he announced it publicly. You, maybe you'll know. And Archie, you can. I'm good. Yeah, I'm honestly. Did you get involved, 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 Slime? I'm not confident. Oh, yeah. Didn't get involved. Uh, slime wants to get involved. You no, no, slime will give it a crack. No, I didn't ask. He said, no. "Oh, oh. Fuck, damn, damn." So many people That's how it be, and no one asked you to get up. My fault. <laughs> you gotta have some bald pride. I feel like, right? It's like, yeah. No, no. Hey, lines are lines. <laughs> I'm, I'm with it. I'm a, I'm a rule follower. Um, you are. So if maybe this, if you're, maybe if you're cheeked up, you get tattoo privileges. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> what, what, dude, you laugh like that, a, like repeat an that anime cringe villain. Uh, you don't think he's cheeked up? Do some, oh, do wait, squats, wait, bro. this is a good reveal. Here's I like what this. I didn't tell you about. Right, we're getting, we're getting cheeked up. Oh this wow, is what, dude, this is what happens when we come on, show podcast me podcast to the two hour mark. I guess it says Ludwig. <laughs> you have that's the Ludwig me. tattoo. <laughs> that's me. That's a, that's a yeah, not a great tattoo, but a great butt. <laughs> a great butt. I like the tattoo. For what it's worth, you know what? Your butt's nicer than I remember, honestly. He has a nice. It's because um, he's been nice working on it. He's but been working it, has on it. A, it has a beard, which is sick. <laughs> it's just tough, bro. You're just like Bill Gates, but you live with Elon Musk. You know what I mean? I don't know what you're <laughs> saying. Like you're <laughs> like I should be, you're I should be almost mad. the richest man Dude, in the world. Look, you just happen to live fine. with me. You're Shaq. You're Shaq. Okay, but he's just Kobe, bro. It's like uh, what yeah. do? Shaq's a better person. Jack's a better person. I guess so. And he's taller. Than Kobe? Than Kobe? Also, I don't know. I don't know who Kobe is. Also still I was, alive. I was like, true. Yeah, Kobe is... <laughs> I hate to break it to you. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? <laughs> <laughs> You're not going to want to know about Drake's cornrows either. Wait, what we got two pieces of news that are going to fuck you up today. Did he retire? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the, I haven't seen him in like... It's the, been a year. It's yeah. been a while. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The, the eternal attire. I still think about the 60-point game. It hasn't done much since, I guess. But. <laughs> Uh, yeah, but Point Point Crow is um he's training to run a marathon inside of his bedroom. Is that a leak? Um, he's running it in a circle. I didn't know about this. This is a thing. He copied this. This, this is a TikToker sounds awful. Yeah, a he's training. So he's probably yeah, he's caked it. up right now, heavy because he's like doing all this training. To, like, I don't think he do started it. his training. No, he did. Oh, did he? Yeah, he told me. He told running me. running doesn't cake you up. Why not? No. Yeah, it, it does the opposite. Yeah, you don't want to do cardio for because you uh, get very tough. Yeah, and no, it's very, you just, like, he just looks either. like he works out. So I'd assume he was doing all sorts of training. He might. Yeah. Maybe. Here's the thing. You ever the, see Arnold running? Arnold Schwarzenegger? Schwarzenegger running? No. What's he look weird? You're not allowed to say that last name. But <laughs> <laughs> come on, man. Yeah, he um, Arnold S. Razzad, Razzad, please up. Uh, he's not. Uh, <laughs> just what? <laughs> you can't say uh, vinegar. You can't say Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> There's a lot, that, a lot of words you can't that, say. That Bo Burnham bit where he's like, yeah. I say, hey, you say ho. And he's like, salt and vin. And <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Put the lights up. Put he's the lights like, up. Hey, who, who said it? Who said it? I saw who said that. <laughs> the camera starts pointing around all the white Those people. Are chips, Those are our chips, dude. We got, bar we got barbecue. We got barbecue. We got salt and vinegar. Yeah. <laughs> you, you get salt chips only. Yeah, you get, you I'll, I'll take the salt ones. You get <laughs> <laughs> Salt and other ingredients, like, please. It's like I'll have flavor, kind of flavor blasted. Is that part of my thing? <laughs> I haven't stopped thinking about white culture since you got here, and I'm like trying to think like monster. You got monster energy. Monster. <laughs> we do have that. We, we have, have box racing. Kyle. Box racing. Sorry. Uh, you got That's you got us. punching drywall. Yeah. Bob Sachs yeah. was ours. Yeah. yeah, beating the shit out of some drywall. Wait. We got yeah. repairing drywall, not our thing, but no, no, yeah. breaking the drywall is our thing. 100%. Skateboarding, Ford F one fifty. No, no, skateboarding's not ours. Yeah, no. yeah Ford F one fifty. What? You can, take, you can take skateboarding. That's fine. We, oh, we get that. You can take it. Yeah, yeah, I'll give it to you. All right, we get. You know when we earned skateboarding? When the white guy in the video who ran with the skateboard, like he was gonna start skateboarding and then keeps running forever. <laughs> that guy reclaimed skateboarding for white people. <laughs> the day Rodney Mullen was born is when you got skateboarding. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I feel like white people get the word marijuana. 
Rodney Mullen went primo one time, and they were just like, oh, "That's the side of the skateboard, bro." <laughs> you know what? White what people do is uh, legal marijuana use since the beginning of time. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, you know what? You know what's called and marijuana? At this right? point, mm-hmm. cocaine too. You know what it's called marijuana? Why? It's because they use the 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 Mexican word, or sorry, the Spanish word of marijuana to like demonize it. Who's, yeah, it's yeah. called cannabis. It's crazy. Who's who's? Why is that? Well, like demon. the like Ameri- the war on drugs. Because you're it, talking about some Ronald Reagan be, shit. Yeah, he invented AIDS. And Bush did 9-11. Right, right. That was what I was going to write on the other Peppa Pig thing, Reagan but I didn't get there. did AIDS. Well, Reagan yeah. did AIDS. <laughs> he mainlined AIDS. But, but yeah, the idea... That one goes over less well. It's like why, why we called it the Spanish flu. It's a way to otherize something that's like mm, scary yeah. and bad. Also, the Spanish flu originated in the US. Yeah. That's right. Dude, I hang out with Hassan and he loves running the... You're wearing a mask, you lib. Yeah. And really? he actually doesn't wear a mask. So it's like, it's like Uber's like, Uber arriving, wear a mask. And then, like, his brother Marat, like, throws on his mask. He's like, nice mask, liberal. (laughs) He just bullies him. (laughs) And then he just gets in the car. (laughs) Dude. Like, out of his million-dollar home. Tell you something about Hassan, bro. He's always complaining about something. Oh, he is a whiner and a kvetcher. I I, I love him. He's a great guy. He is a great guy. Every time I go up to him, it's like something's wrong. Hassan... What, what what's can going I do, on? What can I do Babe? to make it so that we can just hang out? He's probably just always sore and creaky. I think I think uh, discussing things you hate about stuff is a way to bond. You know, it's like a bonding be. thing. Because I mean, we all like blowjobs. We all like ice cream. It's boring, bro. Speak like, for yourself. This guy hates <laughs> blowjobs. I I've never nutted from a blowjob because I'm cut. Have you? Gonna you know me, bro. You wanna get involved? <laughs> I feel like I gotta put my hair up in a ponytail. Right now. Turn the lights off. I can fix him. Turn the lights off, bro. That's why you he's never shaved. had the double-handed fucking vacuum got, sealed gluck gluck. Gluc gluc I will serve you. <laughs> I'm trying to be like that thing that puts the that blows up the air mattress. The first, the first blowjob I ever had was terrible, and I thought I didn't like blow until the second one. Well, oh. that's usually the case, but I've lived my whole life and I've just never been able to finish from it. And yeah. so I'm like, you he know just, maybe he wasn't doing a good we job. We can skip that. We should, part. We should host the uh, the slime suckathon, dude. Like, we, line, we line them up. It's like a kissing booth, but yeah. it's a sucking. You booth. have to do. You have to do your. Uh, you have to get your COVID test first, and then right. you have to get your ID checked, and then. Why would you test COVID and not like d- STDs? Dude, no, it's the slime. The slime suckathon for hope, and we raise money. <laughs> <laughs> and the longer the, I don't bust, the more the money stream, we raise. The stream ends when slime. Bust. Us. Featuring yeah. Dr. Lupo. <laughs> the Slime Suckathon for Hope for Ukraine featuring Dr. Lupo Dude, and Dr. K. On the stage at the end, you're just you're just red in the face. You're so fucking yeah. tired. Dr. Lupo, arm around your shoulder, check in hand, crying. Just. And someone sucks you to completion and they get one of those comical big checks. <laughs> and it's like 10K from the foundation. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh man, I could fill up a measuring cup. Wh- why? Because I'd be, I'd be getting. Because you just be getting sucked. Well, how much? What? How big is the measuring cup? <laughs> two cups. <laughs> 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 measuring cup is two can you, cups. Two cups. Can you tell them that story you told me at ramen? Uh, yeah, I can do that. We, we, you know what? We should convert this to a primo because it's been so long. I think that's a good idea. Yeah, we could do primo. I feel like this is the episode of anime where you just tell the new viewers what's happened. Whole life, you know, it's the catch up episode. It's been two hours. They're all that. I think cut go primo, and you hit him with that sweet story no one's ever heard of from that sweet ramen shop. <sighs> all right, hey guys, thanks for watching the Yard Podcast. <laughs> Look, real quick, real quick, because we're in the main episode. This tattoo is getting close to done, but if you want to see what the finished product looks like, it'll be in the premium episode, which is on the Patreon. Uh, also, shout out to Brandon at Brand Doom. Uh, we'll put it on the screen on. Instagram tattoo artist Outer Limits Tattoo. Uh, thank Don't you so much. Don't fucking bother him. Like you're funny because yeah, you're he, gonna get so many DMs. I'm so sorry for he, that. You, the, Yo, like, I got a, I got a fucking, I got a fucking email from a dude who wanted um, whooper on a skateboard. Oh yeah, that's classic. No way. And I want to know if that's uh, yeah, that was yeah, one of the runners up. Okay. Yeah. That's also, crazy. Uh, another thing that I told you, I think I told someone this uh, the other day when I was googling the the image for this so I could draw it. I googled Garfield in a big hat. And the first fucking image search was a Reddit post about today. Yeah, that's right. And it blew yeah. my fucking mind. Yeah, like I, I felt like boring Matrix. Was Whooper <laughs> on a skateboard, Eric? It must have been. It was named. It must have been Eric. I think Eric wanted to come get tattooed at the same time. Oh, okay. yeah, that's our friend. He's yeah. chill. But what I'm saying is that uh, tattoo artists use Instagram for like actual like life and work. So don't fucking be weird. Yeah, you're allowed to send a meme if you also get a tattoo. That's right. You can send whatever you want. I don't answer my DMs. He doesn't answer. Hey, amen. All right. Shoot it over.
send me nudes. Can All I? right, guys. <laughs> yeah. you, wait, uh, if, you, gonna, if you have nudes to send, please send them to Brandon. You're going to get <laughs> so yeah, many big ass well, balls. Well, I'm, welcome to hell, brother. Hopefully you like uh, Sonic's <laughs> big cock. Yeah. Thank, thank you so much. For, you're not uh, going to get the nudes that you want. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much for watching. Uh, honestly, I'm going to be real right now. I'm not saying this as bait for the primo. It's starting to hurt. Okay. Uh, and so that will definitely carry into my ability to perform uh, in the primo. And we'll see you guys in a, in, a, in a week while my wife. Goodbye. My wife. Bye.